Hello everybody! Hello, hello, and welcome back to Outer Wilds Echoes of the Eye DLC and also base game stuff that I did not finish. <laughs> but welcome! Happy Sunday everybody! How's it going? I hope everyone's been having a nice weekend so far. Mine has been, uh, I slept a lot. I, I, I've, I've been sleeping a lot this weekend. I'm hopefully thinking that means I'm gonna be awake and ready for figuring things out in theory that's what i'm hoping but we'll see how it goes <laughs> but hello hello everybody rika congratulations on the first hi hi akira thank you for doing the the sound alert testing as always i i love hearing snake laugh at me i it, it feels like a good way to start the stream i know that, that sounds a little bit silly but i I'm, I'm really glad I kept in the snake laugh <laughs> as, a, as a sound alert after April Fools because it's such a, a fun sound. But a welcome, 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 Bree. Hello, hello. And welcome, El Castor Candente. Welcome. Welcome back to some more, um, more uh, shenanigans with artifacts. Hopefully this time I won't forget what I'm doing immediately twice in a row <laughs> like last time. <laughs> I still can't believe what I did last time. Like, I was literally saying out loud, okay, I must remember to do this thing. And then it's like the second I step on a raft, I'm I'm just so enamored with the raft ride that I forget everything I was planning. I just, I just kind of want to just keep sailing around. <laughs> it's really nice. It's really fun to sail on the raft. Oh, wait, I wonder... I wonder if I'd be able to do like a full wow. loop after the dam's broken because at the moment like the only times i've swum all the way around swum rafted all the way around has been when the dam is up i bet i could get some like i don't know why i'm thinking like surfing terms now i, I bet i could get some like sick air on the the waves like just go surfing or something that's probably a really bad idea 
<laughs> I don't think I should try and go surfing. I don't think I would survive it. I can barely paddle at the moment without falling off anyway. <laughs> but uh, I'm really excited for today because I left it on such a cliffhangery moment last time. We found an area that seems incredibly relevant and important. And then it was past 1am and I had to end the stream. But that means it's a really exciting point to start with. Unless I drag it out longer and do something else first. I, I, I still don't know. But oh, Jack, hello, welcome as well. Wow. Welcome on in. I'm not sitting up straight already. The stream has only just started and I'm already slouching. There we go. But uh, yeah, I'm, I'm excited to do more. Yeah, first you need to stand up on the board. Learn that in stand-up paddleboarding. I think I'm just standing on it anyway. I don't think I know how to sit down. I'm not sure I even can sit down in the suit I have. Have I ever sat down? I don't think I've sat down in this game. Oh no, I, 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 I literally sit down to pilot it. Never mind, never mind, I'm silly. <laughs> I literally sit down every time I get in the pilot seat. Never mind. Uh, <laughs> but no, the rest of the time I'm just I'm just upright the whole time. I'm just having a little wonder. But yeah, I'm I'm excited to check out more. But also, since last stream as well, before we start, I wanted to mention uh, Limsa very kindly linked me to the website that shows all of the logs. And he also told me how to hide spoilers and then disable the DLC logs and then enable spoilers again to just see the base game stuff. So what I did was I went on that website to see how many logs I'm missing to like cross check them. I am missing six logs and they're from two places. And one of those places is Chert's camp. <laughs> So I think I've got to I've got to keep talking to Chet. I think I'm I'm not sure exactly how, but uh, I'm I'm wondering if it'll change. Like the closer to explosion the sun gets, like the more spicy the sun gets, the more panicked Chet gets. So I think that's gonna be rolling along to Chet and being like, "Hey, yeah, the sun's gonna explode. Let's watch it explode together." <laughs> And then the other one. Oh, thank you for the hydrate. Yeah, that was a really, really well aimed throw. <laughs> thank you for the hydrate. I've treated myself today. I got myself some more peach. I've got my peachy keen monster, so I treated myself to some peach times. So we're, we're, we're fruity today. It's fruity time. <laughs> but thank you for the hydrate and throwing. That was a really well-aimed throw, yeah. I love when they manage to hit me perfectly, but it's also kind of funny when they miss and kind of just knock me on the chin a little bit. <laughs> but yeah, um, three of the logs I need are at Chert's camp, which I think, knowing Chert and how panicked they seemed at some of the points, I think it's just going to be them getting progressively more stressed out as the sun gets spicier. Which is kind of understandable since Chert's camp is literally probably the closest to the sun you can get. And then the other three logs I need are, hold on, what was it? Wait, I've got my notepad. I've got, I've literally made a notepad document. Boom, there. I kept my button from last time too, so I can just bring it up. <laughs> but yes, I'm missing three logs from Chert's camp. And I'm missing three logs from Volcanic Testing Site, which I have not unlocked so far. The only place I can think of with volcanoes, I think that's going to be that Hollow's Lantern <laughs> stuff that I need to find. So I had a little, I had a little go around and I didn't think I spotted anything, but I was also terrified at the time, so I wasn't looking properly. So that's going to be my challenge. For this stream as well. I need to try and uh, find the volcanic testing site and get those three missing logs and then sit with Chert as the sun explodes. I think I think I might make that my first loop. I'm even though I am really excited to jump back into the DLC, I'd really like to get all the logs. I would I would really love to have all of the logs checked off. So I think that's gonna be my my first thing to do. 
I'm gonna go check out Hollow's Lantern, hopefully get the logs there, and then Chert and I shall sit and watch the universe explode. It sounds quite... wait, I was gonna say it sounds quite romantic. No, it doesn't actually. <laughs> it's not actually. Although, I don't know, I could imagine it in like a... like a sad, like, ballad -y type love song. Just be like, I'll sit with you while the sun explodes. We'll be together as the universe ends, or something like that. I'd have a have like a nice acoustic guitar to go with it. <laughs> but yeah, I'm I'm really excited to play more. I really want to play more. But oh, what's not romantic? It is a very pretty blue. That's really true. It is. There is something so nice about the the color of the the supernova as it explodes and destroys everything. <laughs> But far too clueless. Hello, welcome, welcome. All right, let me take my notepad away. So I think I'm gonna start with that. I'm gonna start with. <laughs> I'm gonna start with Hollow's Lantern, and I'm gonna like poke around at some volcanoes, I guess. See if I can find some exclusive stuff. Uh, did we do all the I found stuff with Chert yet? I don't think I did. As well, I was I was like I'll leave you be for now because I think I will scare you with this knowledge, but I have not gone through that yet. So that's probably going to be what I have to do. I, I need to let them know everything I've found out. <laughs> because I've, I've found it all out now, pretty much. I know what's going on now, and... Yeah, I don't think they're gonna take it great, but they, they do deserve to know. Considering they've been studying the sun and, and stuff for, for so long, they they deserve to know. <laughs> and I gotta tell them. I don't want to. It feels bad, but they should know. Oh, Dima, thank you for the headpat. Welcome, welcome. Welcome on in. You're just in time. I'm about to poke around a volcano and hope that I don't um catch fire. We'll see how it goes. I may it may not go well. <gasps> Wake up. Let's start with that. Crunchy marshmallow. I think that's like my favorite tradition so far. <laughs> I love starting every expedition with a crunchy marshmallow. Alright, let's go a boop. Let's go a boop. Right. Oh, yeah! I've also. I unlocked a new thing, I guess, by like stepping into this place. It updated this. But I'm not going to look at that until I go back there again. But we shall see how things go. Let's check out the map. But woo, volcanoes! I'm really terrified for this. I cannot see this ending well, knowing me. But we'll see. <laughs> and Sariad, hello! Welcome, welcome! Uh, you have a word to teach chat today, may you? Well, it depends on the word, but I, I, don't, I, I trust you. I don't, I don't think you'd choose an inappropriate word. Oh, would I like to see it first and try guess what it means? Yeah, let's give that a try. See if I can guess what the word means. I really probably should not have autopiloted to here. This is scary. This is really scary. This is really scary. This is scary. This is terrifying. I'm not gonna try land on it. I, I don't. Can I land on it? Well, I think the first port of, port of call is probably gonna be to examine the volcanoes. Oh, but they keep erupting. It's scary. Wait, there's so. Oh, there's something in that vol. No, there's something in the volcano. It's this. I, there's a lot in that volcano. Okay. Okay, I know what I'm looking at. And oh, the word is M Monegasque. Ooh, I do not know what that means. Right, I'm, I'm gonna go out and fly without my ship. Oh, I'm so scared. Okay, it's not that one. Oh goodness, I'm, I'm very scared. I'm very scared. Ah, uh, someone born in the Principality of Monaco. Ah, that's so cool. I didn't know that. 
That's so funny because I, I have a friend from Monaco as well. <laughs> but I didn't know that word. Nice. I've learned something today. Oh, I'm, I should probably be rotating with... I, I shouldn't be trying to go the same direction as the moon. I should be going like around the opposite way. I'm, I feel like I'm really far away here. It's spinning so fast. It's spinning so fast. Oh, oh, that's scary. Oh, I'm really close to it. This is too close. This is, I don't like being this close. I see where the things are. I just don't know how to. Okay, you, you spew something out. Thank you. Can I get in there? Oh God, I'm not, I'm not gonna be able to. Oh. oh. I got into like the atmosphere of the moon. Oh, hi, hi, my little quantum friend over there. This is really bad. I don't think this is working. Where the heck is my ship? Where is my ship gone? I think my ship may have been blasted. Yeah, I think I think my ship got blasted by one of the volcanoes. This isn't great. This isn't great. Um This did not go as planned. I've got knowledge. Knowledge unlocked. I need to get in the volcanoes. It did not go as planned at all. Ow, ow. Goodbye. Okay, that did not work. <laughs> Let's try and figure out an alternative course of action. How the heck am I going to do this? <gasps> How am I going to do this? Oh my goodness. Mom. Starting the stream with a crunchy marshmallow. Yes, I am. The good old tradition. Hi, Artem. Lovely to see you. Oh, uh, better excited if they follow motorsport. I, I, I'm pretty confident he does not follow motorsport. <laughs> but that's so cool. That's really cool. First time ever winning the home GP. That's really cool. That's really cool. That's really nice. Right, let's try this again. This time I'm not going to get out of my ship immediately. But I I need to... I think I need to observe a little bit more. I think I need to head over. I need to have a look at Hollow's Lantern. I need to observe a little bit more. Also, I'm leaning really weirdly with my model. Give me a second. I need to... I need to fix this. This is weird. Testing. Testing. Okay, that's a bit better. <laughs> I don't know what happened. It was like I was constantly leaning when I'm very much not. But I, I think this is better. But oh, Lost One Souls and Prismatic Sky. Hello. Welcome, welcome. St yes, starting the stream by becoming a crunchy marshmallow. It is I. I am the marshmallow. I'm, I'm just setting myself on fire. I'm so good at it. <laughs> but welcome, welcome. Look, I'm... I only have, like, six more logs in the game. And three of them, I'm pretty sure, are tied to this place right here. Which I'm gonna sail right past because I'm going way too fast. Oh, no. Oh, not too fast. Not that fast. Right, they're, they're all definitely blasting those out are they i'm wondering if one of them like doesn't actually erupt and i'll be able to park my ship on there so i am observing now i'm observing this one at the bottom oh i think i'm close to brittle hollow no they they all they are all erupting i think is this one no i don't think this one erupted i don't know i'm gonna try land on it anyway like a silly fool nope I just broke my cockpit. Okay. I want to find the one that's got the stuff inside it and then try and land on it. And try... Blah. It's 
it's not ideal with a broken cockpit, but uh, hee hee. There, that's the one with stuff in it. I wanna, I wanna see what's in here. It's about to erupt. This, oh, 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 okay. Now I land. Now I land. I, I went too fast. I went too fast. I needed to hover. If I can hover there and then jump out of my ship, <laughs> I can definitely have a look in there. I can definitely have a look around in there. But uh -huh. Okay, third time's the charm, right? Uh, Art, I'm pretty sure there are more logs in the village. No, I've... Uh, I got a, a list of the, the base game logs that there are, and the only ones I don't have are with Chert and with Hollow's Lantern. So I've double-checked. So th those are all I need to complete the achievement. I got all the other logs. <laughs> So I'm quite proud of myself, actually. I think I've done a pretty thorough job so far at figuring things out. But yeah, also, TTV Tay boy, uh, can I rate your Riz? Um, that depends. But you're really asking the wrong person. I'm like the opposite of Riz. I'm, my idea of a pickup line is like, hey, you, you play video games. <laughs> I'm not the kind of person to be rating Riz, trust me. Right, third time's the charm. I, I, I'm pretty sure I know what I have to do here, and the answer is not f fly directly into the lava. Slow down, slow down. Come on, autopilot, I believe in you. I believe in you. Had you had video games? Yeah. It all depends on the video games as well. I could imagine saying that, and they're like, oh yeah, I play uh, Valorant and Apex, and then I'm like, I... I, I I know nothing, I'm sorry, goodbye. Oh, which one was it? Is it this one? Is there stuff in there? No, it's not that one. Which one has the stuff in? Where am I? What am I doing? Oh, I'm brushy! <laughs> I've got plenty of natural risk. <laughs> Thank you, I'm glad you think so, but I, I, re I really don't. But a welcome, welcome. I hope you're doing well. But uh, hey, are you Hollow's Lantern because you're glowing and spewing volcanic projectiles and a threat to the Namai? I don't know. I that, that one would win me over, I think. <laughs> it's better than what I would have come up with. It's this one. It's this one. Okay, I'm going to wait for it to spew. Spew that out. Okay, now I'm going to try land. I land on the side of it, I wonder. I'm very careful. No, I'm just like spinning. This is the worst. I need to wait for it to spew again. I'm taking too long. All right, we spew. I go here. <coughs> Jump out and try and fly in. I'm too far away, I'm too far away. I'm too far. I'm definitely going to perish, I think. Oh, look how close the quantum moon is, though. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. I'm so off. I'm getting further away. This is terrible. I'm so bad at anything involving space where I don't have, like, a safe spot to land. Like, if I had, like, a spot I could land safely, then I might be okay. What if I just, like... No, this is terrible. This is bad. I can't land on this thing. I'm so bad at this. I need to do what I did last time, but not fly all the way in. <laughs> oh, my ship. I think my ship's about to crash land on Brittle Hollow. Oh, don't go in there, please. Oh, no. No, this is... Goodbye. That one did not work. <laughs> oh, getting through. Oh, if he's e -H -Y me, oh, Yes, who is great. You are great. The live and the me that believes in you. <laughs> Thank you, Sarian. <laughs> row, row, fight the power. I uh, touch the untouchable. Um, not, not... 
inflame the inflammable. <laughs> right, let's try. First try. Let's go. Also, uh, Palando, Palan Zero. Thank you for the follow as well. Welcome in. Welcome, welcome. I love that you're joining as I'm uh, throwing myself into fire repeatedly. Welcome. Welcome to what you can expect from L Liri Liri Outer Wild streams. <laughs> But welcome! And Brushy, I hope you feel better soon as well. I'm glad it seems to be settling at least. I hope you're doing all right. And Grace, no, thank you for stopping in as well. Thank you for the luck. I hope you have a, a lovely day. Thank you for stopping in, even though I, I know it's always like spoiler territory. <laughs> but thank you for popping in. I hope, you have, I hope you've had a good weekend. Oh, and Luna, thank you for the head pat. Welcome, welcome. Welcome on in. Do you want to watch me um, throw myself into lava? <laughs> Welcome. But yes, I, I remember when I learnt that inflammable means flammable, I was, I was so mad. I was so mad at the English language. Like, if something's inflammable, it means you can set fire to it. If something's flammable, it means you can set fire to it. It's... why? Why? Right, let's try this again. Uh, the third, fourth time's the charm, right? Uh, I just... I don't know how best to do this because I am so... bad at flying. Right, is there anything in there? I don't think so. I think there was something in this one. Yes, it's in here. Please spew something out. You're not gonna spew something out? Please, please spew something out so I can land on you. Thank you. Okay, now we're aiming for here. This is really bad. I'm so bad at driving. Okay. Oh, oh, my ship has gone. No, I'm too far away. Let me, let me close up, let me close. Let me, oh, not that close, not that close. Oh. Oh, I'm in the atmosphere. I'm in the atmosphere. Oh, this is terrifying and very warm. Oh, oh. Oh my god, oh my god. Ah. Uh, location inhospitable, evacuation recommended, increased volcanic activity detected, increased solar activity detected. I am, you, you can't see, but I am shaking so much right now. I am, I am shaking. I am shaking like a leaf. Oh my god, I'm terrified. Oh god, I'm I am so scared to be here. Okay, here we go. Ha! Huh. Friends in the Timber Hearth mines? The last type of ore you sent us survives the longest in direct heat. Can you send us more of the same for additional testing? We're attempting to improve its durability, and our forge has already burnt through everything you sent. We'll deliver more ore to Hollow's Lantern immediately. You must be fired up about crafting the Ash Twin Project's protective shell. Ah. My gratitude. I imagine we'll also have an updated estimate soon of how much ore is needed to seal off the Ash Twin Project. Will it be more than we initially thought? It will be significantly more. The smallest crack or opening in the protective shell would destroy everything. What's that one? Uh, yes, the idea of an encasement that's supernova-proof, however briefly, has kindled my curiosity. Oh, goodness. Okay, we got a log. What's here? Timber half projection stone. Yeah, this is the spot that's in the... in the mines. Oh, of course. It makes so much sense that this is... Yeah, I, I literally... I'm pretty sure I've literally looked through that projection stone and I still... did not find the little testing spot <laughs> oh goodness me okay and now i'm wondering if there's going to be more in the other areas and i'm a little scared i don't know if there's anything else in here i really really do not like this i don't know if i see anything else in here just a lot of lava it's like loads of lava. There might be stuff in the other volcanoes. All right, let's spew that up. I'm gonna, I'm gonna jump over. Okay, no, this is just like, I 
I missed the ground. I missed the ground, but there was nothing there anyway. Wow, this is terrifying. This is terrifying. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay. Well, uh, I already we already picked up the knowledge of the the mining in Timber Hearth being what created the shell around Ash Twin, but it's good to know they tested it um, in lava, in a volcano constantly erupting and exploding. That's probably the best place to test something like that. <laughs> Oh my goodness, my hands are shaking so much though. That, I think that stressed me out almost as much as the, the anglerfish. Okay, and now here, I got them all, oh. Oh, thank goodness, thank goodness. That's all I needed, that's all I needed. We've got all samples from the Namai mines on Timber Hearth were sent to this volcano for durability testing. The Namai were trying to craft a briefly supernova-proof shell to increase Perilous the Ash landing Twin on project. Hollows like you kept at it and won that fight. <laughs> Rika, thank you for the poem! I did, I won that fight. Slowly but surely, I, persistence pays off. Uh, first try. <laughs> Uh, even the smallest crack or opening in the protective shell would destroy everything. So good job there wasn't. Right, so that means the only thing I have left now is... Chert's camp apparently has five entries, and I only have two of them. So we've got here that Chert set up their ast astronomy gear on the North Pole of Ember Twin. Uh, Chert has spotted an unusually high number of supernovae recently. I think we now have to go tell them that the sun's about to explode. So that's not the most fun journey. Wait, can I just like navigate straight to the camp? I can, okay. There we go. Okay, <laughs> next stop free flying to sun station. I do need to try that. I do need to attempt that at some point, but I, I don't think quite yet. I think I've had enough um, burning to death excitement for now. But oh goodness, my hands are actually shaking after that. <laughs> it was scary. I'm glad I got it though. I'm so glad it was just... Oh, don't fly me into the sun, please. Okay, no, it's not. I'm, I'm overshooting it quite a bit because I panicked about the sun maybe being too close. I'm gonna crash into there. Yep. Thank you very much. Autopilot, my favorite. Headlights and the landing gear are damaged. That's fine. I don't need either of those. I'm a little woobly. It's fine. It's fine. I can can park up here and we can have a full little repair and it'll be like nothing ever happened fixed fixed what else was it oh here yes fixed yeah nothing happened don't worry about it <laughs> right hi chat um hi I got some stuff to tell you. I don't think they're gonna like it. But it should be okay. Right, goodness, it's you! Hello! I take it your first launch went well then? Welcome to the Hourglass Twins. Mine the sand now. I don't remember what I talked to them about, so I'm just gonna go through everything again. Right, uh, what can I do for you? I found something. Uh, I found your notes about the Atoll Rock's main crater. Did you? I hope they were useful. The planet I mentioned may have been frozen solid or just partially made of ice, like a much colder giant's deep. It's hard to say. It used to be the fifth planet in our solar system. Ah, yeah, and then it got seeded. You'll notice, of course, that there's no such planet now. In its place is Dark Bramble, which, how to put this, grew into the space the fifth planet used to occupy. That is... Dark Bramble quite literally appeared at the center of the fifth planet and began destroying it from the inside out. Eventually, the planet shattered completely and its shards were flung across space. 
Some of these shards collided with the celestial bodies in our solar system, such as the Atoll Rock, which I believe is how its biggest crater was formed. Right, and I found on my writing about a hidden planet. How fascinating. It might interest you to know the existence of an additional planet is entirely plausible if you look at the physics of our solar system. It would just have to be incredibly far out there, farther than Harthian ships would be able to travel. And honestly, we don't know all that much about what's out there. The farther you go, the less we know. As such, it's well within the realm of possibility such a planet exists. Yeah, I'm, it's fine. If I can't fly there, I will simply quantum warp there. Right, what else we got? We got, uh, I found my writing about the quantum moon. Oh yes, everyone loves a good mystery, don't they? Who wouldn't wonder about such a moon, uh, about a moon that's sometimes there and sometimes not? I've observed the quantum moon orbiting each of the five planets, but sometimes it quite simply disappears from the sky altogether. Maybe there's another place it travels to. Yeah, maybe there is. Maybe I've visited there. Unfortunately, if there is, I've never seen it. Perhaps if I take a closer look at these star charts. Right, I found Namai writing about the sun station. Is that what's in orbit around the sun then, do you think? This sun station? Quite clever of the Namai to devise a way to study the sun up close and personal. It must have been tremendously difficult to construct. And hot inside, I can only imagine. I wonder how they were able to travel back and forth from the sun station and the hourglass twins when the slightest slip of uh, sl 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 slightest slip up would have meant a fiery death. Oh, don't talk to me about fiery deaths, please. <laughs> uh, I found modern Namai transmissions saying the universe is oh, the. Mm. They're not going to be very happy about this, are they? I found modern Namai transmissions saying the universe is dying. You... what? I don't... um... what? You mean to say there are modern Namai out in other parts of space? And they believe the universe, all of it, the whole thing, is dying? Currently? Right now? If... if that's true, how could I have missed so many signs? The supernovae were there, but I... but... I've been studying the stars, but... well... what does it matter if... oh... I'm very sorry, but I have to look over my charts. I <laughs> hope you don't mind. But, but, but surely I would have seen some kind of other sign than the supernovae, so perhaps? Oh no, I can't talk to them anymore. They're just kind of... Oh no, have, have I like locked myself out of other logs because I've... I've made them have an existential crisis. Hold on, let's see what we got. Yeah, I don't have any new log entries. This, um, hmm. Hmm. I may have made a mistake here. Right, what if I wait here until the sun starts getting more spicy? I'm gonna wait for a little bit of spice on the sun and see if they comment on it. I, I don't know if they will. I don't know. We will see. Uh, have I seen the Chert versus the Sun rap battle? I definitely have not, because I don't want to look up anything about this game until I'm fully done with it. But that sounds incredible, and I will definitely be looking that up when I'm when I'm done with the game. <laughs> uh, have I bugged Chert? No, I I just made them realize the. The life is pointless because everything's about to explode. Uh, oh, hey. Let's take a photo. Hi. Okay. Quantum moon stain here now. A friend. Oh, it's starting to get a bit spicier now. It's definitely a little bit spicier now. You okay? Nope. I think they may just be having a breakdown now. Um... I wonder if anything would happen if I talked to them, like, as the sun's exploding. <laughs> I'm just gonna wait here for a bit, I think. Oh, I could doze off. What if we doze off for, like, three minutes? I'm gonna have a little nap. 
We'll go for three minutes. Oh, that is fair. Watch it later, though. Don't think it has any spoilers that I don't already know. Yeah, it probably doesn't. It's it's mostly the fact that when I'm doing a lot of stuff blind, I don't know if it's going to have spoilers or not. So even if it's completely spoiler free, I, I still like prefer to avoid stuff just to make sure, like just in case. No, nope, still just OK, let's have another nap. <laughs> It's nap for another three minutes. The shortest power naps. Hi, hi, here to hang out a bit with the best space explorer. Oh, hi, Ginka, thank you. Thank you, thank you, welcome. Uh, the best space explorer has currently uh, jumped into lava three times. So, oh, four, four times. So welcome. No, they're, they're still just being like, there's got to be another sign, surely. Yeah, also YouTube might start recommending spoilers. That's true as well. Like, knowing YouTube, if I if I look at one Outer Wilds video, it's probably going to start, like, giving me recommendations for more. Right, how's the sun looking? It's definitely spicier now. Hey, how are you doing? Nope, still just playing away on the bongos at least. I guess they they can't be too upset if they're still playing the bongos. That's a good sign, I, I guess. Let's doze off for another couple of minutes. Let's keep napping. <laughs> Let's go two minutes. I don't even know how far into the cycle I am. There's probably people have made records like when the sun looks like this you are two minutes and 20 seconds in on and stuff oh it's, that's a that's a spicy cheeto nope still okay i'm just gonna keep napping Yeah, I may have made a mistake telling them that the whole universe is about to explode. I should probably, if if this doesn't work, I may have to go back and, oh god, that's red. No, they're still just saying the same thing over and over again. Yeah, I think I'll have to talk to them about the other things and not, not mention everything exploding. Like, I could maybe mention this one exploding. I'm just doing it like three minutes at a time because that seems like a, a decent amount. Oh god, look how red it is. Oh no. Oh here! The stars, they're all dying. There have been too many supernovae for it to be anything else. We're next, do you understand? Our sun! By heart's name, we're next. Uh, what do you mean we're next? It's the stars you see. All the other stars are dying out. Oh, why did we have to be born at the end of the universe? And our sun, it... The star charts, why? Why did I want to update them so badly? I didn't have to know, but no. Oh no, I had to update the star charts. I had to go looking for things I shouldn't have, and now our sun is about to... About to... Oh... I don't feel well. I'd like to be alone, please. Oh. Oh, it's a ship log updated. I got something. Okay, uh, why are the stars dying? I don't know. They're old. Far older than we realized, and now all of them are dying? What does it matter? It doesn't. It doesn't matter at all. Nothing matters anymore. All my research, my life's work, wasted. Wasted, you understand? Oh, goodness. Oh, another ship log as well. Oh, nice. Uh, what are you doing out here? The star charts. It's all the star charts fault. I didn't have to, but no, no, I had to update the star charts. I had to go looking for things I shouldn't have, and now our sun is about to, about to. Oh, I don't feel well. I'd like to be alone, please. Okay, uh, where, where should I explore here? Where should you go? Where can anyone go? Can't you see it's too late now? Oh, who cares? What does it matter? Nothing matters. Yeah, but... 
they're, they're having a time. I mean, kind of understandable. Right, how dangerous is that big column of falling sand? Not as dangerous as what's about to happen to our entire solar system. I love the thought of them just being like, why the hell are you asking me this stuff right now? We are all going to die. I found something. Why isn't that great? Do you know what? I found a few things myself. Most of them have to do with the sun exploding. Uh, right, uh, I was just saying hi. I can't believe this. I can't believe this is happening. I can't. I won't. I won't believe it. Okay. Okay. That's all right. That's all right. That's two log entries. We're still missing one, though. I think there's probably going to be one as the sun is exploding. So I'm going to wait here. <laughs> oh, poor Chert. Yeah, Chert, Chert's taken this well. They're, they're, they're doing... I'm, I'm like, at least they're still playing the bongos. Oh, I'm not allowed to doze off anymore. I guess we're close enough to the moment. Hey, yeah, there it is. Right, what well, if I talk to you now? Oh, hello. Come sit with me, my fellow- <laughs> Sit with me, my fellow traveler. Let's sit together and watch the stars die. If it helps, we're in a time loop, so we won't really die. Ah, that's a lovely thought. Is that how you're coping with this? Does it help? A time loop, he said. I like that idea. Okay, I did it. I completed the ship log. And traumatized Chert in the process. <laughs> okay, we're, we're gonna enjoy the end of the world together. That's okay. We can sit together as the sun explodes. <gasps> also, hello! Hi, Bob! Thank you for stopping in. I hope you're doing well. Thank you for the hydrate. Let me let me have a sip. I don't think there's much point at this point, but I will have a sip. I'm hydrating myself, and I'm about to be dehydrated in the most extreme way, as all of the liquid evaporates from the universe. <laughs> Look at that. Goodbye, son. It's so pretty. Bye, chat. Ha! <laughs> ha, ah, but welcome. Oh, overheated, but doing well. Oh, I hope you can cool down soon. I'm also overheated in the game. Um, I've jumped into lava four times, and the sun has melted me once. So it's going well. <laughs> it's going well, and I'm getting evaporated. But I am so happy I finally finished the ship logs. At least for the base game. I'm free. I'm free to explore the DLC. I still have more things I need to do, but... Or stuff I want to do, mostly. I don't, I don't need to land on the sun station, but I do want to do that at some point. But we did it! Ah! Look at that! All of the stars in the universe are dying, including our sun. The stars are simply dying from old age. Apparently they're much older than we realized. Church has become catatonic in response to our sun's imminent death. Good times. Good times indeed. But uh, that went well! But uh, I'm doing really well, thank you. I'm I'm having a, I'm ha I've had a a weekend of resting, which I've really needed, I think, because my my sleep has been all over the place recently. But I finally managed to catch up on some sleep this weekend, so that's been very nice. That's been very good, and now I'm excited to play play more of this too, because this game is so good. But yeah, I'll just pretend it's one of the emotes unlockable with channel points. Oh, I'll have to make a static version. I'll do it for next time, because I, I I feel like there's going to be more streams of this. Like, with the amount of achievements, there's definitely at least one more. I don't know how much content there is. I think knowing how long it takes me to do anything, there's probably quite a few more streams of this. So I'll see about making a static one for next week. <laughs> so you can unlock it with the channel points then. 
Yes. Ah, uh, War for Love. Ah, oh, hello. You wish you could safely watch a supernova in real life. Ah, oh, that would be that would be really cool to watch, but also yeah, the the safely part is the the tricky part. <laughs> but that would be so cool. It's even like just in a video game, it's incredible to watch. <laughs> but ah, uh, Oh, you don't know what sleep is anymore! I'm so sorry, Bob. I, I'm stealing it. Oh, and this week's been hectic at work. Oh, I hope it calms down soon. I hope you can rest soon. I hope you... Oh, was there something I wanted to mark? No. I know what I'm doing. I know what I have to do here. Right, now it's time to continue with how I ended the stream last week on a total cliffhanger as I made many mistakes on my way to where I needed to be. But I know what to do now, so I should have more time to actually explore things. So we'll see. Let's see if I can remember how to do anything. Let's see if I can remember to open the door without getting really excited on my raft and, um, Oh, oh, oops, 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 that's fine. I don't need my landing gear. Oh, I died? I, un I unbuckled right as I crashed. I'm so... S <laughs> I'm so silly. I thought I was just gonna drop. I didn't mean to press, like, the, the stand-up unbuckle button. I literally destroyed myself there. That's like being in a car crash, seeing the car approach you and taking <gasps> off your seatbelt. That's basically what I just did. <laughs> Oh my goodness, I'm, I'm a genius. This is not the most promising start, but you know what? We're going to call it me getting my silliness out before it matters. I did that on purpose. That was the silly moment. Now everything's going to be flawless. Trust me. <laughs> trust me, trust me. Also, Avas the second. Hello, welcome, welcome. Welcome on in, how's it going? Welcome as I do the very silly things. And oh, Bob, main thing is after work, you couldn't stop working on your VTuber children. Oh, that's exciting though, that's fun. It's okay, I, it's, it, it was a planned move that I definitely meant to do. Like every single move I make, I've never done a silly thing in my life. <laughs> Right, let's be a bit more careful this time. Let's go a tiny bit slower. And then match the velocity. We'll go boop, 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 like that. There, that's more like it. I was just showing an example. <laughs> I was showing an example of what not to do versus what to do. I wasn't. I didn't mean to. I was I was being silly, but it's okay. Fake it till you make it. I'll just pretend I did everything on purpose. Right, okay, my plan of action. I I get in my raft. I get my little artifact from over here. Let's park the raft up here. I sneak in through the river. Whereabouts was it? It's it's this table. Okay. Grab my artifact. Is there anything else like in here? I don't know. I know there's a lot of ghost matter in here. I haven't checked if there's anything else like in in here. There's there's more artifacts on the table though. But I've got my two. Wait, whoa, what is that? Is there an artifact, like, right here? Did I- Oh, no, I can't pick that one up. Okay. I was gonna say, it'd be so funny if there's one down here this whole time, and I don't even have to go in the building, but nah, it's... That one is broken, I think. Right, and now what I do is... I will get onto my raft... And I will bring it up to this little machine dealie over here to pick it up. And I will remember to open the damn door. Okay. 
I'm on track. Everything's on track. We're good. Because now I just head over here. Go in this way. Did it? Oh my goodness, so much talk about uh, supernovae in chat. I, I hope you won't mind me not participating in this conversation. But uh, I, I know nothing about astrophysics. Astrophysics? <laughs> I'm just here like, wow, sun's cool, planet's cool, and that's about all my knowledge is. Right, let's go open that door very quickly so I can make my way through as fast as I can. Right, because speed is what I want here, but I don't want to sacrifice speed for sloppiness, because that's what I usually do. Like, if I go too fast, I usually make silly mistakes. And do ridiculous things, and that's not what I want to do. Right, okay. Wake up. As fast as possible. No, why is it... Drop it in the water. I can't drop it in the water. Get deeper. I was just like, fastest way to wake up, and I did not wake up. Anyway, okay. Okay. Now we head... to the gorge. We're heading this way. Yeah, honestly, I really love space. I love finding out stuff about space. I love, like, the... the knowledge of, like, the universe and stars and everything involving it because it is so vast and unknown. But I, I also don't know anything. <laughs> right, to the gorge. Let's try and drive as safely as I can. Which is probably not the safest. But it's okay. Yes, yes, yes. Carefully, carefully. I need to scoot along to the right now. But hopefully not be picked up along the way, because we need to get to the third area, not this second one. So I'll scoot around here. Things are going good so far. I feel like I shouldn't have said that out loud. I feel like I'm going to jinx it now. Things are going well so far. here. Uh, also, Lyra, hello! Welcome, welcome! Welcome on in! You you missed me throwing myself into the sun and lava numerous times. But it's okay. Oh, hearing from astrophysicists is fun, but you can't do the quadratic equations to save your life. I'm, I'm so bad at maths. Everything maths related. I'm I'm I don't know what it is. I feel like my brain sees numbers and it just kind of shuts down. Like I know the theories behind things. I know theories and what I should be like how to figure out an answer. But I just I'm just no good at it. <laughs> ba -ba 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 -ba. Up we go. Right, the part after this is going to be remembering what to do next. But our half of Astro Maths is drawing spheres. I do love spheres. I'm a big fan of spheres and orbs. And it is this one. boop a doop boop boop a -doop boop I'm making really good time this time, so fingers crossed. Things will go a bit better. Oh, oh, you haven't told me a cool thing you did? Oh, yeah, please let me know. Let me know while I'm um, trying to make my way to the raft I need. I think I remember what to do. I hope I do. Right, because there's like the invisible bridge that I'm going to have to go across. It's so dark here. It's so dark and scary. I feel like I'm just gonna walk off the edge. Right, cause where is... Where's the ledge I need? It is... Here. And I stand here, and we go straight line this way. Whew! 
Okay, okay. Now I can take the lift down. And we can head to the first area in plenty of time. I'm really nervous that I'm going to do something really silly to mess this up now. <laughs> Uh, when in doubt, climb onto a little boat. I'm sure it'll give me a raft of ideas. It sure will. No, don't jinx it. I probably did just jinx it. It's okay. No, we're fine. We're good. We're good. We're good. I'm numing. And uh, you've written a script in Unity 3D that automatically creates and sets AR kit blend shapes for a VRM model. Wait, that's that's really good. That's great. Oh wow. <laughs> Oh, that's gonna make things so much easier. That's so good. I, I need to go really fast ticks. I need the first area. So this is area four. So the next one will be one. And this is where I need to get off when I get in the... Da, 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 da. Right, so now we slow down a bit. And here's, this is where I need to jump off. Do, 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 do. We've still got plenty of time. The dam has not broken yet. Da, 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 da. Made it. Ha. Light the way. dark and now this door should be open because I opened it yes I can get through and now I can set up the bridge I'm, I'm pretty sure they're, they're all still alive at the moment but that gives me time to prepare the environment so to speak likes it's round oh look I can see my raft continuing along how sweet yes here is the bridge and up there-ish. That's what I need to create the bridge. So that's where I need to get to. Ba -ba -ba -ba, which is around here. Da -da -da. I'm on a mission. I'm on a mission right now. Oh, there we go. Right, now the question is, do I wait for the dam to break before I go across this bridge? It might be a good idea because I, I'm no good at stealth stuff, so I think I'm going to wait. I'm going to wait until the dam breaks and I hear everyone screaming. That, that sounds so bad. But, oh, Enrica! Thank you for stopping by. Thank you for the luck. I will have a great time. Thank you. But yes, I hope you sleep well. I'm gonna have some monster. Oh, I heard it. I hear something. can hear it. Sounds really morbid. We're going to wait for the music to stop. <laughs> I don't want to interrupt the concert. No. They don't want me at that concert, I don't think. I probably could do this without, like, waiting for all of this. But I'm too much of a big baby. Yeah, they're, they're still alive. I see that little, that little light down there. I see you down there. Uh, my apologies, I'm waiting for you to die. Oh, there it is. Here it is. Here it is. Now we watch, now we watch. 
Wait for the wind. I uh, mean the water. Oh, that. Oh, whoa. Okay, yeah, we're safe now. Uh, <laughs> oh, wow. They just kind of like evaporated into mist. Wow. Okay, try, time to try and remember my way around. It's so dark. There comes the water. Okay, the water's reached the gorge now. But I'm safe here. Do, 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 do. Right now, where was the staircase underground? I've already forgotten where it was. I, I kind of just stumbled upon it last time. I know it's like somewhere around here. Hmm. Like it, it would be like, which direction would it be? Right, and this is the time where all of the time I saved is going to be lost because I don't remember where the staircase was, but that's okay. Here, here. No, that's water. Whoa. <laughs> oh my goodness, I genuinely don't remember where it was. Ah. Uh, I wish I could see. I wish it wasn't so dark. I wish I could bring candles with me and place them along the way. Yeah, I've, I've fully, I've, I've just, Yeah, I don't even remember where it is. I remember there was a staircase. Uh, that's okay though, this is the trial run. This is the practice run. <laughs> when I do it properly. Oh god, where is it? See, I've turned myself around so much now that I don't even know where back is. Okay, there's the, there's the lodge. Lodges in that direction. Let's go that direction. Trust my instincts. That is the worst advice. My instincts are terrible. <laughs> but I appreciate the, the encouragement. Thank you. I see something over there. Maybe around here. Oh my goodness, what a time for a raid. Hold on, let me pause it a sec. <laughs> Hello, raiders. Hello, Daph. How's it going? Grammy Raid! Come on in! Welcome, welcome! Welcome aboard! How was the Lies of P? I hope you had a good stream. Welcome on in! Bad timing? No, it's more just, um, I am lost timing. I'm lost on a time limit, and I, I'm, I'm just, like, running around in circles, so... <laughs> it's more, like, embarrassing timing. If I was discovering something really cool, then it would be great timing. But as it is, I'm trying to find something I already found. And I don't remember where it is, so I'm kind of just wondering. <laughs> but welcome in! Welcome, welcome! Oh, I'm glad it was wonderful! Thank you for bringing the raid this way! To anyone who's new here, hello! I'm Liri, I'm a pink-haired cat girl from the UK, and I love comfy games and puzzle games. And this game isn't really there on the comfy side of things, but the puzzles and investigation in this game are incredible. It is so good. I'm currently playing Outer Wilds. I'm playing the Echoes of the Eye DLC, and I've done a lot of stuff. So if you don't want to be spoiled for Outer Wilds, beware there be spoilers here. <laughs> but uh, thank you for bringing the raid this way. If you want to stick around and lurk, you can just laugh as I fail to find a staircase I already found once. I genuinely don't remember where anything is here. It's so dark. If it was not so dark, I might have a chance, but I, I'm directionally challenged at the best of times. Like, turn the lights off and there's no chance. <laughs> but if you have to head off after your stream to or rest, get some food or drink, please don't feel like you have to stick around, but if you want to. Uh, we're having a great time at the moment with me just fumbling around in the dark, unable to find anything I'm looking for. See, like, following pathway seems like it would make sense, but... <gasps> I found it! I found it! Oh, I found it! 
we're gonna run out of time, I think. But I found it. <gasps> oh, here we go. Okay. 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 I should at least still have a tiny bit of time to explore, I think. The tiniest bit of time to explore. Tiny bit of time. We go in here. Da 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 da. And we know this is not a real fireplace because the fire here is blue. Oh, I made it. I made it. I made it. And I still have no idea where that staircase is. I wandered so much that I I would not be able to find it again, I don't think. <gasps> oh, the music. Oh, wow, the music. What is going on here? Insert artifact? <gasps> oh, my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, we got it. It's story time. I have not put a reel in. Never mind. I need to put something in before I can view it. That makes logical sense. Oh, but I can check this. It, of, of course. Of course it's burned. Of course it is. I should have known. I should have expected that. <laughs> also, Petab. Petab's. Is there a specific way to pronounce that? I'm sorry if I made a mess. But thank you! That's really sweet of you to say. Right, what do we got? Let's... It's video time. What do we got? This is... Oh, the planet! Yep, there's the Eye of the Universe. There's our solar system. It's zooping. It goes zoop. All the way to, I presume, a different solar system. They're picking up the signal. Ah. Whoa, check this out. Hey, check out this, this funky signal. That's gotta mean something cool, right? Oh, these are the, I think these are the slides that were burnt away before. They're flying away. Look, that's the, that's the stranger. They're flying away. Th th this is the exact same thing the Nomai did. This is what the Nomai did. They they found the signal and went towards it and things went wrong. Oh, goodness. Okay, wow. Alright, next, next reel. We got another one. It's movie time. Movie time. What do we got now? Uh, why do you always get roasted by everyone? Did I, I? I didn't roast you. If I said anything that seemed like a roast, I, I was not intending for it to come across that way. <laughs> oh, I'm no good at being mean to people. I'm sorry if I said something that could have come across as a roast. I, d I didn't mean it. <laughs> but yeah, this is so cool. Right, what do we got here? Okay, the sailing through the matrix. Oh, is it like a, a loading system? Oh my goodness, it is. It's what I thought. Like, they made this whole program. They made this program as like a simulation of their world, I guess. Wait, what are you doing? Hold on, where was that? Which one was that? Which one was this? Hold on. Yes, it's like a, a little little loading sequence? when they go through the caves to get to the next area. Okay, there's two islands there. And they jump off, like, in the loading? In the cave? What does that do? I clearly have to try it now. That's interesting. Okay, and... There are more... There's so many reels here. Can I reach them all? I don't think I'm going to be able to view all of them. Oh no, I can't jump. No. I can't jump that high. I, I always forget. I forget I don't have my jetpack. I don't have my jetpack in the Matrix. I can't get over there, I don't think. That's really mean. That's I wanna I wanna view them all. But I can't. Oh. Right, well I I feel like these were the important things anyway. 
Oh, that's so sad, though. But there's so many. Oh, is there a way I can get up there? Hold on, let me get my artifact. I need to see you. It's not like a hand I can zoop to. No, I don't think there is. I was hoping I might be able to bloop. But I don't think I can. I can't see anything else around here. What's going on back there? I have no idea what's going on back there, but that is... Is that just like a, a light reflection? Oh, it might just be a light reflection, actually. Bam, bam, bam. Oh, thank you for the hydrate! Akira, thank you for the hydrate! I, I, I'm not going to have enough time to do anything else here, I think. But I am so glad I got to view these. I didn't get, like, a, a log updated thing or anything with them, though. So I, I hope if there is a log thing, it will have counted it. I think it would have. Right, so when I get to there, I need to get on the raft and jump off. That's what I'm getting from this. So that's what I'm doing next time around. It's it's this area with like two islands. I think that might be the second area. I don't know, I'll keep my eyes peeled. But if there's a reel about it, I think that means I have to try it. <laughs> if you want me to jump into the abyss, I will happily jump into the abyss. For science. Bop, bop, bop. But yeah, it's very interesting that it's it's so similar to the what the Namai did as well like they got the signal for the eye of the universe and set off like oh god this is devastating too because this is like they're stripping their whole planet of resources to to make this so it's like even after discovering this if they went back to their planet it's been like decimated there is nothing left here that's so sad. I guess that's why they made their virtual world. So they can be at home even when they're not at home. Oh, it feels so sad. All right, let's go back up and have a little explore before the sun explodes for like maybe a minute. And we'll see. Uh, how do I know the little guy didn't just drown? I don't, which is why I have to try it. <laughs> He could have, and that's why I gotta test it out for myself. Right, there might be other stuff around here too, because I, I didn't have a look around. I just jumped into the fire immediately. I don't think there is much else here though. It's a very, oh, it's a very lovely lodge. Oh, look, they're playing like a board game. It's like chess or something. Some kind of peace-based strategy game, which I would have no idea how to play. Oh, it's, oh. What was that? What the heck was that sound? I don't know what that sound was. I thought everyone was um gone. Hmm. Ow. Okay. Landed a bit heavier than I meant. <laughs> yeah, I don't think there's anything else here. If there is, I'm not going to find it because the sun's about to explode. But yeah, I think that's all the important stuff anyway. Oh, I'm so glad I made it in time. I thought I was going to run out of time again. Okay, right. What I'm going to do is I'm, I'm going to go through this cave. I don't think I'm going to have to go back here but just in case I'm gonna try and like figure out how to navigate here from where I come out where is this I don't know where anything is from here where is this 
all the trees look the same. Oh, wait, it's so close. Oh, that's so funny. It's so close. I literally go all the way up here until I find, like, the first tree. And then it's, like, around the corner from here. Is it around the corner from here? I've already lost it! Ah! I lost it again! I'm so bad at directions! I don't know where I am! Any of the time! I do not know how to navigate anything. This is embarrassing. Well, I'm glad I, I found that place. Um, good job, I hopefully don't have to go there again. I, I just spin too much. It's like I saw that and then it's like... Tree? There was a tree. Is it this tree? No, it's not that tree. Which tree is it? It's this tree. It's this tree. It's this tree. It's right here. Okay. Okay. At least I found it again. That was embarrassing. <laughs> anyway, um... Don't trust me with directions if we ever go hiking or anything. That's all I will say. See, it's kind of funny as well because if I'm given a map, I'm really good at like planning out routes and giving directions on where to go on a map. But when it comes to just like walking around without street names, <laughs> I have no idea where I'm going. Right, well, that went well though. I'm happy about that. I'm so happy about that. Uh, you learn this from Minecraft. Oh, me just getting really lost in Minecraft and then being like, Lyra, can you come pick me up? And I'm like five squares away from where I was. <laughs> ah, okay. Well, here, burn slide reel. Oh, here, slide burning room. I found a hidden slide reel that shows a container marked with a glowing symbol being handed to a shadowy figure. No, I saw that one. So has nothing else been added for finding all- Oh no, it's down here. The Forbidden Archive. Here it is, that's more like it. A library full of intact slide reels hidden deep underground. There is a container marked with one of the vault seals, but its contents have been destroyed. I found a slide reel that shows the origin of the stranger and its inhabitants. Intact slides reveal the sacrifice that was made to build the stranger. And I found a slide reel that appears to be some sort of error report. It shows one of the stranger's inhabitants jumping off a raft during a transition between areas and falling below the world. I want to clip out of bounds. That's our next challenge. That's that's my next task. We're clipping out of bounds. Let's, let's go. Let's go. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm so good at accidentally breaking things. I'm here to purposely break things this time. <laughs> but, oh, you're the exact opposite, Sky. That's so funny. Together we'll be unstoppable. Yes, just give me a map, and then as soon as the street names stop, you're, you're in charge. <laughs> yeah, oh. <laughs> Remember during the, the voting April Fool's update when our world got haunted and the sound of the doors helped us find the way back? That was the best. <laughs> I loved that April Fool's. That was so good. Minecraft, I really love how Minecraft actually makes, like, full working game modes as April Fool's jokes. It's it's very dedicated. It's very good. Right. I shouldn't have unbuckled as quickly as I did there, but it's okay because I'm fine. Right, and we know what we gotta do this time. Yeah, this time I don't think I'm gonna need to open that door. I don't think I need to go to one. So I managed to skip a big journey here. We're going to go straight to the gorge. I'm going straight to the gorge. We're going to go straight there. We got a nice little raft journey. Let's see if I can keep the music going. Uh, signs point to no. Uh <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm so nervous. Through the rapids. I'm definitely getting better at driving the raft. I feel like I shouldn't have said that. I'm going to crash into something now, but... 
right, then we want to head up to here. Round and to the right. So we can head to the gorge. I'm doing really well this time. I'm proud of myself. Even if I crash now, I won't be mad because that first part of the journey was so smooth. I'm proud. Right, this is going to be the tricky part because we need to... Whoop. This way. We need to... Yes, I made it. Now if this can just pick me up, yeah. Oh, clipped it slightly towards the end, but the music didn't stop. A perfect journey. <laughs> Go. Right, let's head in. I am ready. I am ready to jump into the loading void. This is my specialty. This is my specialty. Jumping off things to possible certain demise. That, that's what I'm really good at. Boo, 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 boo. So let's head into here and pick up the artifact over here. I think it was like right behind the door, wasn't it? Yes, it's right there. Hey, hey. I got my artifact, we're going in. I don't know where I'm going, but where we're going. Ba, 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 ba. Move these out of the way. Let's have a quick marshmallow. Yum. And now it's raft time. I can't wait to probably jump off in the wrong loading sequence and just fully destroy myself. But uh, we'll see. We'll see how it goes. Lighting it up. I ate that one while it was on fire. Yeah, it makes it, like, extra warm. It's very nice. Right. Over the bridge. I'm always so scared going over the invisible bridge. I'm always worried I might, like, misjudge it. But I didn't. I'm using the trees as, like, a... a baseline of where I can stand. <laughs> You're so right, the fire consumed me earlier, now I consume the fire. Fire thinks it can stop me. Nope. I have proven myself many a time. I am very resilient, especially against fire. <laughs> oh, that was a bit of a far jump, but I'm okay. Right, I'm pretty sure it's not this loading sequence that I jump into. I mean, I probably could, but I'm not going to. Right, that's the big vault one. I don't think it's here too. I don't see like the two landmarks. I think that was like the second area. I think I have to go all the way around. I still need to find that hand as well that I can zoop to. I think it might be on the opposite wall to what I've been looking at. So I still have to try that as well. Here's area one. Okay, I heard the dam. I'm going so fast, but I'm going at like an angle. I don't know if I was meant to, like, bash into the wall there. Alright, well this doesn't look like the place either, because I think it would show the lodge as a landmark if it was this place. 
Oh, look at them. Listen to them singing, though. Oh, it's it's so sweet. They don't know they're all about to perish. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. Here. I think it's this area. Maybe. This one has, like, the most, like, rocks. I feel like the rocks up here... I think this is also going to be where the, like, the high five hand zoop's going to be, but I can't figure out how to... Is it up here? Is it up here? No. No, but that has the two, it has the two rocks, so I think it's this loading screen. I just want to see just in case the hand is here. No, because that's like a light put out thing. No, I don't know where to zoop to. Right, this is- I'm, I'm gonna jump off into the abyss. Can I listen to the sounds? Goodbye. <gasps> oh! Oh! I'm walking on the water. Oh my god. Um <gasps> This is the the vault area. Oh my god, hold on. Where do I need to go here? I've forgotten what I need to look at here. Jim. I've forgotten where I need to go. <gasps> oh, this is very handy. Alright, so there was one area where it was like you can't get across without the raft. But now if I can just walk on the water... Is it here? It is here. I made it over here. I can take out the second... <sighs> I took out the second thing. Am I gonna have to do all three of these at once? Oh, goodness. Oh, goodness me. Okay. Let's go across. We got a- we got a- we got a raft now. I don't know how to get to the third one. But, uh, I know how to put out the first one. Because that one just involves a little bit of matrix work. Here, I can- I can see where the bridge is here. Oh my goodness. Okay, so I've- I've got two out of three. Okay, the bridge is there. I know I can walk straight across now. Also, Zara Keller! <laughs> Sorry, I got- I got so- I got so, like, into this moment. I got so invested in this moment. I- I was just completely zoned out. Thank you so much! <laughs> Thank, I, I I love how I just heard the the gym as well, and I was just like, yeah, that's just normal. That's I hear gym in my head all the time. <laughs> but thank you so much for the hydrate posture check too. Let me have a big stretch. Ooh, ah, and a sip of my monster. <laughs> time to start cat girl religion. <laughs> Jesus was so cool. They made a sequel. <laughs> Oh, please, please do not compare me to Jesus. I feel like a lot of people would get very offended. I'm- I'm nowhere. <laughs> ah. Alright, so now we can take out the first one too. I don't know how to do the third one though. <sighs> okay, so we got one and two out. Oh, the third is the big alarm thing. Alright, but I can- I can definitely get more knowledge from this vault. Now that I've taken two of these out, let's... Does it rotate? Yes. Okay. Rotate again. Get more info. Yes. From the second. Hello. I'm... I, I already saw this. I already saw this one. I want the second one. I want the knowledge of the second one. 
I put out the first one, I want the knowledge from the second one, maybe I shouldn't have gone back and done the bridge as well. <laughs> I thought I would need to do like all of them, so I just instinctively... Ugh. I saw this. I saw this. I want new things. I want to see new stuff. Ugh. Yes. I did that, and I found the room with all of the codes that were burnt and not in there. Can I view it again? I want to view the second. View more? Is this going to be the same thing again? It's the same thing again. Okay, uh... Right, well, I've... Taken out the second one. What if I, like, relight the first one again? I'm going to see if anything happens if I relight the first. If it'll even let me. Very possibly might not let me. No, I can't relight it again. Okay, that makes sense. But how do I get to the third one? And can I still walk on the water now that I've jumped back up? Yeah, because this one had the big alarm that's going off. Anytime I try to get close, the alarm just... rings. Hmm. Oh, can I go up and, like, around this? Oh. Where's this? Where am I going? Where am I? <gasps> What's this? I don't know if that's doing anything. Oh, there's a lift! Oh, that I I ne that nearly crushed me. <laughs> Oops. Uh, where does this lift go? Oh, that was really dangerous. That was nearly... I nearly got squashed again. <laughs> oh, goodness. Where is this? Where are you taking me? Where am I? Oh, am I just back here? Oh. Oh, I guess I'm just back here. Hmm. Right, I need more information on what... What the heck the third one's deal is. I don't have any- oh, maybe- oh! I'm probably gonna get a hint for that one. If I figure out how to turn off the alarms around the well. I think that's gonna have the hint for the alarm bridge. Because I also got like the, the real clue for that. And I still have not been back to that area. And like checked out the if I can take take out all the lights and go down the well but that one also had friends because I think that's the second area I think that was the second area and honestly that's probably the area I've spent the least amount of time in oh wait they they'll all eventually die as well if I if I enter from the gorge and go back hmm Right, now that I've done the second one with this. Yeah, I still don't know the code for the second one. I just, like, hacked my way across. <laughs> See if there's anything else over here. What? I don't think there is. Yeah, I think this is what I was meant to find from that. It's how to, like, take out the second uh, seal on the vault. So I think my next task is going to be going to the second area. But uh, I think with that as well, what I'm going to do is I'm going to do what I did this time. Pretty much. Which was to go from the gorge and then just take the raft there. Because then that buys me a little bit of time. Because otherwise, if I enter from that area from that tower, I'm also going to be woken up when it starts to sink and flood. 
and that little bit of extra time could be all I need to find important things. Right, it's time to test. Can I still walk on the water? I cannot. Okay. <gasps> test successful. Right, I don't know how much time I have left. I don't think I have enough time to really explore anything. I think the sun's going to explode very soon. But I might as well give it a shot. I might as well give it a try. I might as well attempt to get to the second area. Who knows? Maybe I'll get very lucky. I'm just waiting for the first note to hit at any point. I need to call it back to you. Ugh. Well, now we know. Exactly. I did it for science. And it's okay, because in the Matrix, uh, if you die in the Matrix, you don't die in real life. However, if you die in real life, then you're gone from the Matrix, too. We have learned many things in the name of science. All right, this is all just trials at the moment. Just see if I can find anything. If I can't, at least I gave it a shot. Boop. Right now, fast. We go fast. Fast, fast. I wonder what happens if I jump out of the other loading sequences. I guess I could try that. Yeah, this is area four. So area one was the one with the fireplace. I found that. Area three... What did I find in area three? I don't know. I have not explored much of area two though. But area two was the one with the alarm and the well. Hmm. But I really need to try and find that hand that I can zoop to, because I'm pretty sure that is in this area, area two. So I need to have a look out for that as well, but my priority this time is going to be just jumping off the raft when I reach the the point where I can disembark. <laughs> That's my plan of action. Oh, and Bob, thank you so much for stopping in. Gonna go try and sleep. It's late, but it's still too warm. It. I really hope it cools down for you soon. But thank you for stopping in. Thank you for spending time with me. Hopefully it cools down soon. I wish I knew where that hand was. I want to zoop. I want to zoop. Where do I zoop? I need to zoop to turn off the lights, I'm pretty sure. But I can't find where to zoop to. Where do I zoop? It's like it definitely looked like these rocks. It's like up here and then like this. Oh, I nearly walked off the raft. Because that's where I need to get up to, because that's where it turns off. The well, I'm presuming. Okay, yeah, I've just done a full lap. I don't think I can actually disembark here. I think I'm going to have to enter from two. Let's clip out of bounds again. Right, I wonder if from here I can go anywhere else. What's over here? Let's have a look. Oh my goodness! Yuri Raid! Bamboozler Raid! Hello! Welcome! Oh my goodness, hi. Hi. Um, I, I clipped... I clipped out of bounds. I'm... Oh, I ended up... Oh my goodness, I'm here. I'm here! I'm back here! But I still can't reach anything! Oh my goodness, that's the worst. 
I'm in pain. Oh, this is this is so sad. Oh, but maybe I can use this to my advantage. Going some way. Oh no, the world is ending. The world is ending. Let me pause. <laughs> Let me pause a second to say hi. Hello, Raiders. Welcome in. Welcome, Yuria. I hope you had a good stream. I hope your stream went well. How's stream? Um, I've um died a fiery death many times. Um, I've I jumped into lava four times. Um, the sun jumped into me once. Uh, I've drowned a couple times. Uh, things are going really well. <laughs> like, unironically, things are going great. I love this game. <laughs> but how did your stream go? How was it? I hope you had a good time. Welcome in, bamboozlers. To anyone who's new here, hello. I'm Liri. I'm a pink-haired cat girl from the UK. And I love comfy games and puzzle games. And um, you may have guessed from what I just said, this game isn't really the comfiest. This is not a part of the comfy side of what I stream, but it's an incredible puzzle game. It's an incredible puzzle detective game. And I've been having such a blast with it, but I, I will say ahead of time, if anyone wants to play Outer Wilds and you don't know anything about it, uh, please look away. This game is the kind of game you need to play unspoiled. <laughs> And I'm very, like, endgame stuff now. I'm doing DLC content. But if you don't mind about that, uh, you are welcome to stick around and join me as I um, probably die many more times. <laughs> but I'm finding out so much as I do. It's great. Yeah, the world is ending, but it's okay. Because um, Outer Wild spoilers begin because I'm stuck in a time loop. So it's okay. I just get to experience the world ending on the loop constantly and learn new things every time it's <laughs> it's a really great game though i love this game but i hope your stream went well as well yuria thank you for bringing the rate this way thank you and if anyone wants to stick around and join me i i say it's not comfy i'm still aiming for like comfy vibes even though we may be dying a lot we're still having a good time whilst doing it <laughs> we're just chilling i'm just like world's about to end Okay, let me see what I've got. Let's let's have a look around here. Let's have a little wander. Let's have a little hike through the forest. <laughs> but yeah, if you have to head off after your stream and go get some rest or food or drink, please don't feel like you have to stick around. But if you do want to stick around, um, I'm I'm I sure I'm doing things. Okay, looking back at this now, it's it's very obvious where it wants you to go because it's literally lit up. <laughs> but I wonder if I can go anywhere else. What's around here? Ooh! Oh, that looks like a ledge I cannot go down. That's okay, I'll keep wa walking on water a bit more. Uh, is there anywhere else I can go? if I go this way? Well, the, I'm pretty sure the the sun's about to explode, so I'm going to be dragged forcibly out of here. But this is so fun. This is so cool. Being able to just break the matrix. Yeah, I think this little lip here is going to be where the where the outer boundsness stops. Oh, whoa! Look over there. What's going on in that place? Oh, hold on. Oh. Come on, just 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 kill me. It's okay. It's all right. I can't see. Over here. I might be able to investigate more over here. Oh no, this one's got the lip as well. Oh, but I wonder if I could, like, jump onto the rocks. No, I don't think I could. Let's try. I'm about to die anyway. Whoop. No, I can't. And... And I'm dead. But it's okay. <laughs> I'm alive again. Oh, I think what, what I need to do now is I, I... It's like that one bit with the bridge. I need to figure out. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to try and experiment a little bit. 
by going into like the fourth area and just trying a bunch of stuff with the bridge and seeing if anything works. I don't know if it will, but I can give it a try. In, in the name of science, I'm just gonna try silly things. Right, did this update? Ah, ba ba ba, nope. Oh, but it's still saying there's there's more to explore here at the Hidden Gorge. I'm not sure what else I'm missing there. Hmm. Hmm. Because to be honest, every time I've been here, I've kind of just made a beeline straight for straight into the Matrix. So, <laughs> so there probably is more to discover. Maybe I just have a look around here. See what other stuff there is. Oh, because there's still... Is there still something I'm missing? I'm not sure. Oh, secret mural. Yeah, yeah, I, I, I did that. Yeah, the lights are extinguished. The figure carries the container into a secret passage behind a mural of a large tree. Oh no, did I do that? I haven't done that. That's at the... That's at the Hidden Gorge uh, Matrix area. I don't think I did that. I haven't gone through that. That's something I can do. Oh. And then the other one is this, which is the, the secret well. <laughs> can I... Can I zoom in on... I want to zoom in on the slideshow. So here we go. Taking the raft. Yep. Blah, blah, blah. Heading through on the raft with the number two thing. Hand it off to that person. Yeah, they're handing it off. All right. Keep going on the rafts. Where is this? There's like a derelict house there. And then, yeah, it's, it's like tucked away. There's a hand. I need to find that. I need to keep doing raft journeys until I find that hand. I, I need I need to find that hand. I'm I must. I must. I have to. I <laughs> That's what I wanna do the most at the moment. I bleh. I feel like I've looked so many times and I just keep missing it every time on the raft. I'm because it's like right in between rocks. Whereabouts? I think it's probably got to be close to the the machine put out the lights thing. I'm pretty sure it's going to be close to that. I just don't, I just seem to keep, I think my problem is every time I go past, I keep looking in the exact same places where I know it is not because I've already checked those places. But my, my brain still keeps going, well, it, it's probably here, even though I know it's not. <laughs> All right. Okay. I didn't mean to do that. I meant to do that. Okay. I don't know why I just shot my scout out. It's fine. Right, do I... Explore, explore more at the gorge? Maybe? Yeah, because the two things I need to do are the put out the lights and go through the painting. That was nearly bad. And... Okay, I think I need to enter to... Oh no, I still need the artifact. need the artifact. Wedge this here. If I lose... If I lose my raft, then so be it. That was my silly fault. But uh, I think I'm, I still need to pick up the artifact from here to enter from... But uh, I'm going to enter from the second area, even though I know everyone will be around. And I'm on a time limit. Just because I really have not explored much of Area 2. 
I need to have a, a better look around. I got so distracted by three because of area three having like the raft and everything. <laughs> And it didn't look like there was a place I could dock the rack? Dock, dock, dock the raft? Rack? What, what am I on about? I didn't see a place where I could, like, stop the raft and jump off in Area 2, so I think I might not be able to access it from there, which means I need to access it from inside it itself, which is over here. <laughs> so let's give this a try. Oop, oop, oops, it's fine, it's fine. I think area two is about turning off the lights for the well. I think we will see. And there goes the beautiful raft music. Wait, I'm going away from it. What am I doing? <laughs> I gotta go up it's really been a while since I came in here like especially from this entrance right I think I'm, I'm pretty confident I'm probably done with the first area I think I found the important stuff to be found from there So it's areas two and three. And this one also has like the empty, the empty bed as well. So I am very curious about area two. I didn't mean to roast a marshmallow, but we're here now. But yeah, I'm, I really haven't explored this much. <laughs> like I, I managed to accidentally parkour myself to the entrance where you're meant to find the hidden bridge to get over it, and that's about all I've really done here. I really haven't done much. Yeah, because I managed to light up using one of the light up things. Oh, that one over there. I'm pretty sure that one lit up this path that sent me through to, like, the secret area. But I've already seen that. So let's have a look around. I'm pretty sure there were friends here. Yeah, there's the well. Because there's a well in the middle, but it's got that big alarm that goes off any time I get near it. But I know there's a way to turn that off. I just haven't been able to reach it yet. I probably need to be on a raft for it, question mark. Oh, the music's so ominous here. <laughs> Ooh. I'm a little scared knowing that there are friends about in this place. I definitely saw one before. I saw one like roaming on an upper level somewhere. But uh, that's a where a lift can go to. Right, the question is, do I leave my artifact behind for a bit. I think I might. I think we're going to leave this over here for now. Oh no, I need it to zoop over here. I see. I need my artifact to noom over there, but... And this down here... Oh, I can just jump over that. Nice. Haha. -ha. Where am I? Oh, this is the... This is an uh, alarmy thing, too. I don't remember what I did here. But I'm pretty sure this is an alarm as well. Hmm. I don't know. It's been so long since I explored here. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm gonna need my artifact to high five across. Yeah. Oh, up there. There's something up there. I bet that's the one I need. I bet that's the thing I need. 
And I bet I'm not going to find a way to get up there because I'm going to have to do the Noom from a raft, <laughs> which I have not figured out yet. But yeah, because this is saying just like, it's just like a no entry sign. It's telling you not to go this way, but you can just ignore it. And will this be different if I... Oh. Yeah, having the artifact made that go off. Hmm. Because I could go up to it when I was, like, in Matrix mode. Maybe that's what I have to do. Hmm. Mysterious. Anyway, let's go over here. A bloop. Five. Oh, I thought that was a staircase then. It's a roof. <laughs> I need to figure out where this high five is. Because, like, if nothing else, even if I can't reach it, if I can just figure out whereabouts it is, it would make things so much easier for everything else. I bet a bridge can appear here. Oh no, there's a lift! Oh, there's a lift up there. Hmm. Alright, I'm over here. Yeah, there's the well. I'm pretty sure the thing to put it out is like that direction. It's high five. I like the high fives. It's like they're, they're like grabbing you and pulling you over. It's just like, hey, come over here. Have I explored? There's like nothing here. Oh, I, I bet I need to extinguish these. Oh, I can blow them out. Yeah! I can just extinguish them and I can walk through here now. And there's a lift! Where does the lift take me? Down. Oh, it takes me down to where the well is. Mm. Hmm. Can I go through here as well? What's this? Oh, I accidentally lit that candle. Okay. Phew. I thought I just like locked myself out then because I, I lit both of them. What's in here? What's in here? I'm just opening all the doors. Ooh! Oh no, this is the bridge one. This is the... Yeah. Yeah, I, I already did this. I don't need that. Oops. I'm very unnerved by the fact that I haven't seen anyone around yet. It makes me wonder where they are. It makes me worry where they are. Oops, oops. Alright, there's a there's a space for a lift. And yeah, there's the well. But I have not been able to put out the lights, so I'm not gonna be able to Yeah, I'm guessing turning the lights off here is gonna make the, the well not alarm at me. Oh I'm like right back at the beginning now. I see oh yeah, that's the cave I went through. Ah, yeah, I've still made no progress on figuring out where the heck this hand is. So it's going to be along, like, the raft path. Oh, it's not down there, is it? Oh, no, that's going to call the raft. <gasps> Wait. That's actually handy. Hold on. Oop, I heard something. Uh, this tower may start collapsing. I may not have time to sail the raft, but I can try! Because I don't know where the hand is! Oh, I nearly missed. Where's the hand? Where is there a hand? I don't know. Me. Do I just do a full lap again? I guess I just do a full lap again. <laughs> it's 
Let's make our way back to this area and try and find that hand. See how fast I can go. <laughs> I'm gonna have a sip of monster while I do it. Oh, oh, never mind. I think I'm gonna wake up soon. I'm gonna be forcibly woken up soon. As the tower collapses. And actually, what I'm gonna do is... I'm gonna wake myself up before the whole tower goes down. To hopefully make it a little bit easier to get out. <laughs> Here it comes, there's the water, the tower is sinking. And that's gonna sink a little bit more soon. Right, okay. Go on a little raft for a bit. This is my new raft, thank you very much. At least until I can reach that one right there. Oh, don't float that way. This is my raft. Haha! <laughs> I have a raft. Let's see if I can get to the gorge. It's it's like it's such a waste of time at this point. I don't think I'm gonna have time to do anything relevant. But I can try. <laughs> I can but try. The dam's down, but now I'm not. I'm I'm still up. I'm still here. Ugh. 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 This way. That way. That way. Mm. This way. Thank you. <laughs> Just making noises at the raft. Like going this way. Right. Park. Perfect parking, yes. Ba, 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 ba. Let's head back back in. I don't really have much time to do stuff, but I I'm gonna make the most of every second I get. But yeah, I didn't feel like there was a place I could get off the raft into the second area but i know there is going to be one and that is going to be the hand that i can high five that zoops me over that's gonna be the way to get onto solid ground in the second area i just need to find it i'm su i'm surprised at the fact that i haven't so far i thought i was so sure of whereabouts it would be and I was completely wrong. <laughs> okay, I'm awake. Thank you for the tutorial. It's not like I've done this before. here and boom yeah I always kind of hold my breath a bit when I'm going over there I don't know why it's like even though I've I've done this path so many times now I know where the bridge invisibly is I still hold my breath Right, here we go. It's time to try and find that hand again. Please. Please. Also, Alnom, hello! Welcome, welcome! Welcome. I'm, I'm trying to find a hand to grab me. And I haven't found it so far. Like, I wonder if I can steer the raft. Slightly. Like, it's, it's on a path. It's like an on-rails kind of raft. But I wonder if I can steer it, like, slightly influence where it goes. No, I don't think I can. Just speed it up and make it boop into things. <laughs> I just need to find the hand I can zoop to. It's gonna be in the second area. I'm pretty sure. 
I can't, I'm pretty sure I saw like the, the there's like a derelict kind of hut. And the hand was like in between those. I'm pretty sure it's not this area. Pretty sure it is the second area because that's also where the well is. And I know the third area has got the the tree thing that I need to turn the lights on for. So it's got to be the second area. If I miss it in this run through of the second area, I'm going to jump off into the void again. No, I'm not actually. I'm, I'm going to do another lap. I've got, I've got enough time, probably. Maybe. Slow down. Derelict hut. No hand. No hand to high five. In between the rocks. Because it, it was like, it looked up and then to the right. In the reel, and I'm not sure if that's like... Oh, I think I just saw it and I missed it, maybe. No, it looked bigger in the reel. I don't think it... I don't think it'd let me miss it like that. God, where is it? It's... Oh, I'm losing my mind over this. I need to try something else. Where would where would it be? Where would it be? <laughs> Cause there are rocks here as well, but I'm about to go into the next area is it here no nothing here no okay let's do another lap actually you know what let's not do another lap let's try and figure out how to eliminate the lights in this area to get through the the tree painting i'm gonna do that instead I don't have much time left, but I'm, I'm gonna just try and do as much as I can. Maybe. Maybe. Maybe not. What is that sound? I heard that sound before as well. I don't know what that sound means. That sound happens, like, after everything else. You're dying. Hmm. Right, I know I can sneak around the back here. Into the launch, but I can't put the lights out. Okay, here we go, here's the end. It is the end of the run. Yeah, th these are like proper lamps. I can't extinguish these just on my own. These are like proper lamps. So I need to do the extinguishing thing to turn all these lights off. Oh wait, I wonder if... Oh, I just had an idea and I'm not going to have time to try it. Can I get in matrix mode? Here. I can't go through here. Can I eliminate, eliminate them? Can I extinguish them like this? I cannot. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, because the only way to get to there is from the other side. But I'm pretty sure I know how to do that. I've definitely been on that side before because I made this bridge appear by lighting up through it. So if I do the opposite, I go there and I extinguish everything. And then I come back around and go across the invisible bridge to reach it from this side. I think that's what I have to do, and then I'll be able to get through. <gasps> oh, that was enough to wake me up, apparently. That was, like, lethal fall damage. Cool, let's roast a marshmallow as the sun explodes. Nice. The music has stopped. When do I stop? Now I stop. There we go. <laughs> okay. I got a plan of action. I'm going to focus on 
the third area because I'm pretty sure what I need to do can all be accessed from the third area. Like, the way to get to what I need for area two, I'm pretty sure it's it hinges on finding that high five to, to zoom to. So I think I can access everything I need by entering through the hidden gorge. I hope. We'll see. But uh, I'm pretty sure that going through will give me a hint for something. And then I'll be able to hopefully figure out how the alarm things work. Figure out a way I can turn off that alarm in the vault area to remove all of the seals at the same time. <laughs> Ooh. It's exciting! Oh, I really love this game so much. I'm. <laughs> I, it feels really devastating as well, knowing that it's. It's basically the same thing that happened to the Namai. Like they they got the signal of the Eye of the Universe. They went towards it. They realized. They were doomed. They surrendered themselves to perish. Although at least the Namai managed to get away. A lot of the Namai did survive, managed to move to a different solar system, but um, that doesn't really help when it's the whole universe. <laughs> but yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm sad that I can't communicate with the strangers. Like, the fact that they instantly just run up to me and blow my candle out. Why do I keep getting my scout out here instead of my flashlight? I like that the game just gave me another little control pop-up, as though I'd forgotten how my flashlight worked. <laughs> but... Alright. Back to the gorge again! So gorgeous. <laughs> Being xenophobic is bad, okay? Alright, I'm... Although it's like, I can kind of understand, like, they've made this whole virtual world if there's suddenly someone in there that they don't expect. I think I would also be like, okay, get out of here. You, you are not invited to this party. Uh, <laughs> but at the same time, I'm not, I'm not there to cause any harm. I just want to enjoy the concert. I just want to have a good time. Maybe watch some films together. <laughs> to the gorge for a third time. Because I'm going to have to be careful too, because I know there are there are people wandering around in the gorge. No, don't pick me up, don't pick me up. Yes. Because I've seen them wandering around in the gorge, and I know there's the, the one person who's like watching movies who got mad at me. <laughs> So, on my way to do everything I need to do, I need to make sure nobody spots me. I need to be very careful. But I've already done it once. I've already made it to that area once. Don't remember what I did, but um, I, I know I can get there. So then it's just getting there, turning off the lights, and also managing to get back to the entrance to then take the, the secret path along. No, I missed the thing. I missed it, no! Go back, go back. Go back, go back. It's not gonna go back, is it? It's not gonna go back, is it? Ugh. Please. It's not going back. Ugh. Well, I guess we're doing a lap. Oh, actually, no! Okay, everything went wrong. I didn't mean to miss my stop there. However... I can still use this to my advantage. Let's go experiment with the alarm thing. Over here, see if there's anything more I can do in the vault area. It's like deep in the water. I'm pretty sure I've explored everything around here. Mayhap. 
Could I explore in there? Have I been in there? I don't know. <gasps> yeah, because I saw this. I saw the, the hologram that's... Hold on. What, what is that? Trying to tell me. Oh, wait, no, I can't do this. I don't have an artifact. I was going to pick up the artifact from the gorge as well. Oh yeah, that's just showing the layout of the the inside. I know that. Ba -ba -bum. Nice little jetpack reload. Ooh. Yeah, the control thread have been completely destroyed. Let's open that door. I'm up here because I don't think there's an artifact thing around here. Unfortunately. Yeah, I think if I want an artifact, I am going to have to do another lap. That's okay. I can do that. I can do that. Let's let's go on a lap. <laughs> uh, I'm I'm very good at video games. All right, let's go around again. Let's go around again. Maybe we'll turn back the hands of time. What an appropriate song, actually, if you think about it. <laughs> right, this time I need to make sure I don't miss my stop at the gorge because that it's because the the river is flowing so fast there it makes it so impossible to turn around and go like against the stream against the current oh okay we start moving the dam's gonna start breaking let me get out of here while that happens i don't want to be here it's okay it's still got a little bit before it breaks Going around again. It's okay, I'm, we're just going on another raft journey. Yay! Good times. Don't go into that, please. Thank you. I get as far right to the right hand wall as I can. Yeah, honestly, it's not difficult now to get to the gorge. I, th I think I've kind of nailed the the actual sail there. I, I, I think I've got this down now. I know where I'm going. <laughs> I have perfected the path to the hidden gorge. Was it? Is it even called the hidden gorge? I've just been calling it the hidden gorge. I think it's what it's called. It could be something else. I don't know, it's the gorge. Right, and this time I won't miss. Please. Yes. Ha! Goodbye, rapid music. <laughs> it's a long rapid music, I love you. Oh, I love the art here as well, though. It's so pretty. Right, this is going to be really risky because there is the very real possibility that the dam might break as I'm walking across here to grab my artifact. But I'm hoping it won't. Oh, I guess if it does, I, I do have plenty of warning. It's it's going to take a while to, to flow around to here. Oh, yeah, I'm fine. I'm fine. I wonder what else I have to explore here as well. What else I'm missing here? Do I... Do I have a look around? Maybe I'll have a look around. I'll have a little look around turn instead of... 
going into the Matrix. Because I've, I've been doing a lot of Matrix diving. And... Oh, there is a little bit, like, sticking out there. I wonder if I can... get in there the same way I did before, by, like, sending the lift down and just... jumping down the hole. That's how I got to, like, the real part. I wonder if there's anything else I can access doing that. Whoop. I don't think there is. There might be. Yeah. The real room. No, I think all the rest is at the bottom anyway. Oh, unless there's stuff down. No, that's just a hole. That's just a hole in the floor. I don't think there's anything down there. Um. Oh yeah, because this lift machine is broken. I wonder if there's anything... Like, hmm. No, that is empty space. Okay. But I, th there's like a little grassy bit over here. I wonder if there's anything over here that I might have missed. Cause there's a, this is a nice little, little ledge. Have I been in that? Oh yeah, that's the theater room. No, this is just the base of everything I've already looked at. Okay, well, at least, at least I've got the elevator here. Oh, can I get back up here? Yeah, I can get back up here. Right, let's go back up. Because it says there's more to explore here. There's got to be something else here. Did I look in that room? I did look in this room, I'm pretty sure. Oh yeah, I looked here, but I couldn't get in. But I wonder... Okay. Scout can't get through that gap. And get around from the other side. Oh, there's a power line here as well. I wonder if something different happens in this room after the power line's been taken out. On the roof. From the roof, can I very carefully boo boo boo? I'm in. I'm pretty sure I've explored this place before, but oh, I can launch my scout down here though. Ooh. 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 Hmm. Oh god, that, that scared me. <laughs> oh, I just got jump scared. I got jump scared by the dam breaking. Because it's like, it's not just the sound, but also when the dam breaks as well, like the controller vibrates. <laughs> and it's terrifying. Can I get in? I want to get in this room. I want to get in that room. Because there's stuff on the table. It looks like a reel. Have I seen that one? I may have already seen it, honestly. But I don't remember doing it. It's probably something I already have. Oh, it might be that I can get in there very soon when this dam... Oh, it's already destroyed all that stuff. Oh, never mind. I thought it might destroy some more stuff around here. Hmm. Oh, wait. Hold on. Oh, no. Where is that door? Where's the door in here? It's like another room. I, th I thought I'd be able to like do the little cheat with my scout to open the door, but I don't think I can. I, 
can't see the door from here, I don't think. No, I don't see door. Hmm. What if... Hmm. I'm sending my scout at different angles to see what I can see. And the answer is nothing. Hmm. It's like, this is probably nothing. This is probably something I've already found. But I don't know for sure. Which is why I want to go in there. <laughs> is there a way I can get in from underneath? I can't tell enough with my scout. Yeah, because that's a reel. I, th th that's going to be what I'm missing from here, I bet. It's the reel in here. How do I get in here? Cable's still attached. Ah. It's like, I wonder if I can shoot my scout at the cable and, like, break the power. I don't, no, I can't. It's just, like, phasing through. <laughs> oh, but there's a little... Ooh. Hmm. Hmm. Let's have a look over here. Have a look over here. Also, Lumsev, hello! Welcome, welcome! Hi, I'm trying to do questionable things. I don't know what I'm doing at the moment, but I'm trying. I don't think there's a way in from here. Maybe. I don't know how huh? to get in here. How could I get in here? I wish I could get in here. I wish I could break things. Also, Zarok, thank you for the posture check and hydrate as well. Let me have a big stretch. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> I love I love the sad violin into the uh. Yeah, me me being sad as I can't get into a room I want to get into. I'm pretty sure this is going to be like the one thing I'm missing from this area. I just can't figure out how to get in there. Let's, oh, oh, can I see the door from here? Hold on. I can see the door from here. I did it. Oh my goodness, did you see that first try? Did you see that? First try, first try. I've I've nailed the scout door opening. I am so proud of myself for that. Oh, I really hope I have time to view this reel. I really hope I can get over to the theater in time to actually view this reel. And thank you for all the confetti too. And thank you. I feel like I'm gonna run out of time because I have to run over and grab a lantern as well. But I'm gonna try my best. I gotta see this. This has gotta be like the the one the one thing I'm missing here. I, I think it's gotta be. <laughs> Alright, let's go get a lantern, I believe. Yes. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Yes. <laughs> Forgotten real is forgotten no more. Oh, that was close. That was that was too close for comfort. It is no longer forgotten. I found it. Oh goodness, the one thing I was missing from here. Finally. <laughs> movie time. Quick, quick movie time. Ooh. Huh? What? Whoa, okay. That's turning. Oh, bloof. Splort. <gasps> Error. 
Yeah, that's like the that's like the landing. Oh my goodness, what does this mean? Yeah, this is like the the landing area. What is happening? Whoa. Is that someone being... No, what, what is this? Oh. That's so interesting. I can't believe I missed that. Can't believe I missed that the whole time. I... Oh. Oh, I'm so glad I found that. I'm so glad I decided to stay behind and... Not jump back into the Matrix. <laughs> oh, I'm so happy I found that. That's... So intriguing. Like tr trying to figure out what's going on here. It's like, ah, hmm. oh, that's like the main like landing entrance, and then there's like the four points around it. Is is that going to be the four areas inside? Like the one, two, three, four. <gasps> Wait, the one the one person that's not asleep in that one bed. I wonder if it's I wonder if this is related to that. I think this might be related to that. Because like looking at this, it's like it's got all four of like the points. The four areas. I'm pretty sure that's gonna be like each of the the entrances to the matrix, pretty much. And there was the one that's missing. What happened? What the he oh. It's like... Explosion. It's kind of similar to what happened... Like, in the first area when I was watching as the whole place got flooded, they all kind of, like, exploded into that kind of fire, smoke, dust circle. But it's saying, like, that's, that's an error message. That's clearly an error message. Oh, that's interesting. Oh. oh, I want to do more exploring in the second area. Oh, do I do I jump in the third? I'm gonna jump in the third just for like a tiny bit. I'm pretty sure the sun's about to explode, but I want to jump in for like the the shortest amount anyway to try and remind myself of what's going on in there. <laughs> Ready for the next one, because I'm I'm jumping in next time. Yeah, it is the second area where there was the the one missing. Oh, this is so interesting. Wake up. I know I don't have much time, but it's okay. Oh. That sound happens every time as well, like just just before the sun exploding. I'm pretty sure there's like an invisible bridge somewhere around here. There's also a way to create the bridge across. Yeah, that's happening every time right before the music starts for the supernova. Okay, there's the bridge. Interesting, because that was like the same kind of death sound. That the the other strangers had when they died. So is someone here dying then? Somehow? Hmm. Hmm. Because I'm pretty sure this is the only place where people are still alive, so, hmm. Yeah, because when I'm here, I need to figure out a way to get... Oh, the concert. I need to get to that first room again and turn off the lights in that whole first room so that I can go through the, the tree painting. It's 
not going to be this time because I'm about to perish. But uh, I'm, I'm getting more of an idea for this place. Yeah, is this, is it? No, it's not this one. Hmm. Oh, it is this, but it's from the other side. Ah. I need to be on the other side to eliminate in this room. I see. Haha. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that was a... F I, I was going to say that that was a fruitful loop. I'm just thinking of fruit loops now. <laughs> it was, though. That was... I'm glad I decided to stay behind. To try and find that, like, missing information. There's more to discover here in the Hidden Gorge. Because otherwise I would have... I don't know how long it would have taken me to find that other reel as well. And that one is... Oh. Oh. Nice. <laughs> Fruitful. For real. <laughs> oh, I also love that reel a lot, though. Also, hi, TJ. I'm sorry. I was, like, I was so engrossed in everything I was finding. I didn't actually say hi, but hi. Here we go. The whole breach. Uh, I found a slide reel in the hidden gorge that shows an explosion blowing a hole in the side of the stranger. I want to, like, investigate that. I want to see what's going on there. What happened there? So as we... As I enter, I want to check that out before I actually go in. Because that's so interesting. That's... I wonder what happened. Not knowing what we're looking at in Outer Wilds. <laughs> Captain Picard was... Yeah, that's that's me not not knowing what's going on, but trying to figure it out anyway. Oh, I'm so I'm so glad my ship is here to to fill in the gaps for me. I love how I see like the fire and the smoke, and my instant thought is just like, oh, well, the people kind of exploded in like a fire and smoke kind of way. Maybe it's related to that. Right, let's try and find. Which spot? Okay, this is whoa. This is a really bad way of doing this. But uh, I don't think it's on this side. No, these are these are all lit up and fine, and it doesn't look like anything's exploded around here. I think it might be on this side. A little hard with my cockpit damaged, but that's okay. I don't need it. I'm not doing a very good job of driving here. I think I'm gonna try and I'm gonna try and land and fix up my ship. Boop, boop. A little boopy, a little boop. A little boop. Okay. Okay, I'm in. I'm gonna try and fix my ship. Before I have more of a look around. Oh, I guess I can just like point my face out and have a look as well. It might be easier to see than being in the ship itself. Like, if I just step out towards the edge like these? I see a blinking red light there. Where am I? What am I doing? Maybe I shouldn't be doing this. No, maybe I should be in my ship. I think I made a mistake. I'm so... Oh no, I got, I got out of range of the, the stranger's orbit. This is really bad. Okay, okay. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna go back to my ship. I don't want to do this. I don't want to do this on my own. Ow, 
now. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I'm okay. I have medkits. <laughs> a little red light. I don't know if that's like outside of the stranger. I think that's more like outside of the stranger, yeah. What's going on here? Have a look, what exploded? Can't see anything, I wanna see what exploded. Whereabouts was it in comparison to like the exit? I've already forgotten. Anyway, the starboard hull is damaged. I don't care. Let's head back in. Head back in and repair. No, 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 oh god, I'm I'm so stuck. I'm stuck on another ship right now. This is that was not the most helpful, but it's okay. <laughs> Hold on, let me have another look. Da, 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 da. Have a look. Yep. Little explosion. Where's the error? It's like two to the right from the entrance. Like, if the entrance is at the bottom, it's like clockwise two more from that. Hmm. Let me fix this. What's damaged? Oh, wait, this is what's damaged. Okay. <laughs> I, love, I thought I was walking around the other side and I was just like, but my ship looks fine. What's the problem here? What needs repairing? Um, all of that side. That's okay. So it's like two is this one. Oops. That was a nice crack. Yeah, two is like here. Hmm. Yeah, this isn't great. I'm gonna go around the other side. If I don't destroy my ship first. A very real possibility. I'll come back to the stranger. I'm going quite fast. Okay, no, we're okay. So it's uh I'm gonna go like as slowly as I can. Like this one? Like here? Was that what broke? Hmm. Hmm. Oh, look, the shutters are up now. Ha ha. Is it about to start moving? Will it move, like, with me in it if I'm, like, out here? Hmm. Yeah, I'm not sure where this explosion happened. I think it may have just been repaired since I... Since that reel, which would make sense. I think it'd be, like... Here? Oh, yeah, this looks like where it happened. I'm going out. I want to have a look. I'm going to go have a float out. I may lose my ship along the way. That's okay. I'm already lost where I was. Yeah, this isn't great. I'm already floating away. Ah. Over here. 
But yeah, this looks damaged. It looks damaged there. That's that's the spot. That's the spot. Can I reach it? I'm gonna hit something. These beams are like rotating me away from it. It's over here. Okay. Yeah. Yes, it's all oh, look at that. What happened here? Oh. oh 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 what's it oh it just no <laughs> where am i what just happened hi sis i'm a welcome in thank you for the raid oh my goodness you joined at a great time i don't know what just happened but I'm a little devastated. I just found that. And now I don't know what's happening. <laughs> but welcome. I hope you had a good stream. Thank you for the, the Sapphic Sunday stream. Welcome on in. Hi. You totally didn't almost raid someone called... <laughs> oh, that's why I always copy paste usernames. I, I always get so paranoid. But thank you for bringing the raid this way. Welcome in, everybody. To anyone who's new here. Oh, my goodness. Another raid. Oh, my goodness. Double raid. Wait, this is great. I can just do my introduction twice for both of them. Oh my goodness, Loxley, hello. Welcome, welcome. Thank you so much for the raid. Come on in. Welcome, welcome. How's it going? How was the Hades? Oh, were you playing the, the first one? First Hades? Because I, I know Hades 2 is early access at the moment. Have you been like trying to do the first to, to finish it for when Hades 2 comes out? Or... <laughs> But thank you for bringing the raid this way. Hi. How's it going? Welcome on in. Uh, I love that I'm just paused on a black screen at the moment because I don't know what just happened to me. I'm sure I will soon find out. But uh, something has happened as I went through that hole. I don't know if it's just like bad timing or if something actually happened, but we'll soon find out. But hello, raiders. To anyone who's new here, hello. I'm Liri. I'm a pink-haired cat girl from the UK, and I love comfy games and puzzle games. This game isn't really the comfiest, but it's an incredible detective puzzle game. <laughs> I'm having so much fun discovering things in this game. It is so good. Even if I am now apparently 300 meters away from where I was before, uh, I'm sure it's fine and not a problem. <laughs> Yeah, I've been playing the first one for a while, never got to the end of the story and want to show the story on stream. I see. Oh, I, I hope you get there soon then. I hope you had fun with it. I've got to say, I've never played Hades myself, but I've watched lots of other people play it. And I really love the story of that game so much. <laughs> like, I've started watching people playing Hades too as well. And it just looks like Hades again, but more of it. And I think that's that's all it needs, really. That's That's what people need. It's what people want. They're just like, hey, can we just have more of this? And they're like, we got it. Here you go. Have some more. <laughs> yeah, uh, you, you were played at some point. Oh, you played the technical test. Yeah, waiting until it releases fully because your priority is the story. Yeah, that makes sense then. Because I'm uh, pretty sure the early release is like, it just stops the story at a certain point. I think that would frustrate me <laughs> if I was playing it like that. So yeah, I fully understand that. But that's great as well, because it gives you time to, to finish the first one, the, the story of the first one on stream. <laughs> but yes, thank you for the raid, both of you. Thank you for the raids. I got a back-to-back a -back raid there. Thank you. <laughs> but yeah, if either of you need to head off and go have a rest or go get some food or drink, please don't feel like you have to stick around because, because you raided. You are welcome to just... Raid and, raid and run, I don't mind. But if you do want to stick around for a bit, um, I'm, I'm doing a lot of floating around in space at the moment. <laughs> but yeah, thank you for sending the raids this way. Oh, thank you for the hydrate as well. I will have a sip of my monster. And uh, I'm not sure if what happened right now is just like bad timing. Where am I? What have I done? I'm not sure where I am. 
I think I got through like the little hole on the surface. And I could just like keep walking this way. But I'm walking. Like there's this is like ground that I can stand on. So this is very interesting. Hmm. Oh, it's so dark. What is this? Because this is where the explosion happened. I kind of just jumped through. What is going on in here? How can I get in here? Oh, you need to raid and run to not spoil yourself? Yeah, that is absolutely fine. Uh, thankfully, I'm at a, a part at the moment which is very... Um, even if you do see it, you won't have any clue what's going on, so it's not, like, spoilery. <laughs> But yes, please, if you want to play this, it, it's such a good game. I, I think you'd love it. I, I think you would really love it. But yes, uh, it's it's so good to go in as unspoiled as possible because it's really, really good. But thank you for the raid. Very appreciated. I'm going to... Oh, where am I? There's something like in there. Where am I? Yeah, there's something like here. What is in here? Oh, oh my God. Oh, oh, this, oh. Ha, 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 ha. Oh, ha, ha, I found something. Oh my God, this is, oh, blah, 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 blah. This is the room, this is the room I kept seeing. This is the room I kept seeing that I couldn't get into. Oh, what is this? What is this? Yeah, that's that um, got exploded. Oh my goodness, this is the room I couldn't get into that I was so curious about. What is that? There's like projectors in each of them. Can I get in there? Let's have a look. What is this? What is it projecting? Let's see. Artifact. Oh, is this going to be like artifact tests? Oh. Um. Well, that wasn't uh, terrifying. There's an artifact here. Oh. Yeah, that fire is not lit and I don't think I can light it oh my god there's a real there's a real here too I need to view that I need to look in all these rooms first though oh my goodness I can't oh this is so cool there's another artifact hello okay okay this is a way in that also provides me with artifact that is good to know oh my goodness I'm so glad I kept fighting to try and get through that gap What's in here? That's just... What? Hold on. Is this the artifact? That's just a lantern. Okay. Experiment. Oh, these are all like prototype artifacts, aren't they? Okay, this one did not work. This artifact did not work. Oh, there's more in here. Are these all like prototype artifacts? Oh. What else is in here? What's the difference between these? Oh, this one has like the lantern. Oh, there goes the dam. Oh, this one doesn't have like the focus conceal thing. I'm, I'm, I'm hitting LR. Ah, oh, but I, I guess this this is going to be the test in here, but I can't view the projection for that anymore. Because it got exploded. Right, well, I need to view this reel. I have to view this reel, so oh my goodness. I'm, I, I was so curious about this room. 
I'm so glad I finally made it into this room. I, I need to view this reel, please. I hope there's still a way I can view this reel, even though the dam's just broken. Where even am I? I don't know which area I'm in. I've forgotten which area this even is. Is this the second one? Is this the second area? I don't know. No, it's the third, it's the gorge. Oh, that's that's great, that's great. I know the theater room is safe here. Oh, but how do I, how do I get across though? Uh, there's gotta be a safe way across here. I guess I can jump over there. Oh, I really want to try out, like, the other artifact, too. See what happens if it doesn't have the... the other stuff. Because of that room... Oh! I have a theory. I have a theory. Uh, because that room exploded, my theory is that without the focus conceal mechanism, the artifact exploded. That's my theory, and I want to test it. Because I'm like, why would that room explode? And I, I, that's that's my theory now. I want to test. <laughs> so I hope I could check this reel out and go back there to try and jump in and see if I explode. That's like, <laughs> this is like the, the most silly idea. But I must try. Right, what does this one say? Yeah, this is going to be like information about the... The, the artifact prototypes. Okay, first prototype. We go in that room. Hello, first experiment. Nope, that, that one just doesn't light up. Artifact two. Experiment. Yeah, I... Okay, third artifact. Is this the one that works? Yep. Yeah, that's the one that works. I think my theory's correct, and I must immediately try it out. I I desire to blow myself up. I must. I have to for science. I <laughs> I probably shouldn't be this excited to blow myself up, but um, it's just me. I have to. I have to try it. <laughs> Okay. I have to try. I must. No, it's not that way. Where was the room again? Oh, it's like up this way. Where was the door? Wait, where was the door to get in here? Hold on. Like down here. Here it is. It's, it's right in here. And then this artifact <laughs> cannot conceal or focus. Oh, I hope I blow up. I mean, what? <laughs> oh, I think I'm right, though. I think it, it was a wild theory before that I just kind of thought of as I was like, talking about the artifacts and then remembering that it just exploded out of nowhere. But now I think I'm like actually right and it's going to explode. If I take this to the campfire. I hope it does. I hope it explodes. I'm so excited. Da, 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 da. Which one? Ba, ba, ba. It's this one. <laughs> okay, I'm so ready for this. I'm so ready for this. Here we go. Huh? Oh! Oh, there it is! Yes, there it is! Early adopter attempt to use the second artifact prototype. 
<laughs> Curiosity killed the cat. Wait, that's the best. <laughs> that's the best achievement. It's so true. It's so true. I'm I am that cat. That's me. <laughs> oh, that's amazing. Oh, I'm so glad. That's so good. <laughs> the early days of VR development were very dangerous. <gasps> yeah, I can't even imagine how much how difficult it would be to end up like in to create a world like that and figure out a way to project yourself into a world like that. Like the kind of technology involved there is wild. Let's have a look. Damaged laboratory. A laboratory with three test chambers. The second chamber is badly damaged and can be entered through a whole breach in the side of the stranger. I saw a vision-like recording of someone picking up an artifact and going to sleep in front of a green fire. The rest of the vision was distorted and difficult to make out, but a flame seemed to appear inside the artifact. I found a slide reel that shows three experiments conducted with three different artifacts. The third experiment appears to have been a success. Ah, oh, that's so good. Oh, imagine seeing all this before using an artifact ever. I, I would be terrified. I'd be terrified to pick them up. Oh, that's so good. I'm so glad. Right, what am I doing now? I, there's still more to discover at the Starlit Cove as well. Yeah, that's the well. I need to figure out how to stop the well from ringing alarm bells at me. And uh, to do that, I need to find the the hand from this reel. We got this reel here and I don't know where this hand is. Alright, you've got you've got number two. I'm handing you that thing, yep. I hand you code number two, which is probably also burnt now. And then you continue sailing along. And there's a hand zoop up there. Where is... I'm trying to figure out. Yeah, this has got to be in the second area. Because that's where the well is. How do... I don't know where that hand is. I need to figure out where that hand is. Uh, oh, these projections are how you're supposed to learn about sleeping at the bonfires in theory. Ah, uh, yeah, that makes sense. How did I, how did I figure it out? How did I figure it out? I, oh, mine was the reel where I saw them all go, like, around and then just, like, flop. And I tried sleeping, not expecting it to actually work, and it's... It took me into the Matrix. Yeah, I think I got lucky. I, I, I found it through my um, try silly things and see what happens approach, which is how I've discovered quite a few things. <laughs> see, it's just proof that in a game like this, do silly things. It's worth it, trust me. Where even is this? I don't even know where this is. I'm trying to figure out where it is from this image it's there's a tree up to the left is like oh it's like a the bridge it's like right before you reach the bridge hmm okay i think i have an idea maybe of how to zoop to that hand i'm not sure we'll try we'll give it a try Uh, yeah, a lot, a lot of just let's try this. I'm, especially in a game like this, which rewards you for trying things out. I'm, I'm so willing to just do stupid things, and I'll be like, I don't think this is going to do anything, but I'm gonna try it anyway for science. And a lot of the time, it doesn't do anything. But on the occasional time that it does, it makes it all worth it. I didn't mean to turn my headlights off, but it's fine. I don't need them on. Yeah, we're fine. We're fine. It's fine. We're fine. What did I break? 
What did I break, you? Hold on, what did I break? Oh, it's fine. It's fine, I don't need my ship anyway. But yeah, I just need to figure out where that hand is. But I think, like, knowing that there's the bridge going across and a tree on the left, I should be able to get the right position from there, I think. Maybe, we'll see. To area three. Oh, oh, do I do that or do I try and turn off the lights in area three for the tree painting? I need to do both. I could do either. I think I'm going to start with area two trying to turn off the well alarm because I'm most curious about that. And I think I have a better idea of, like, whereabouts the hand could be, like, in comparison to everything else. I feel like I've judged, a, a, like, a tiny bit more where it could be, as opposed to just, it's between rocks. Because <laughs> the it's between rocks did not really help, because everywhere was rocks. There were rocks everywhere. But if I, if I use the tree and the, the bridge walkway across, as, as like signs of where I should be looking and when. I think I should find it, I don't know. Plus I'll just, if I'm just entering from the gorge either way, I can do both. I can, if trying area two goes really, really badly, I can just hop back because I'll be in the right area. Please pick me up. Please pick me up. Please pick me up. Please. No, don't go past it. Please. Oh, I went past it. No. Yes. No. Can we go back. Oh. Oh, it's going. It's going. It's going. Oh, thank goodness. I thought I missed it. Oh, thank goodness. I made it. Also, Omnilinx, hello. And Gambler, hello. Welcome, welcome. Welcome on in. Welcome to me being very smart, doing very smart things. Sometimes. I may have thrown myself into lava quite a few times this stream, but it's okay. It was for science. Therefore, it's fine. Also, I've not been squished by an elevator today, so that is... <laughs> I'm counting that as a success. But yeah, welcome, 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 as I think I know what I have to do. And I attempt to do it. We shall see whether I actually do or not. Oh, I'm so glad I found that exploding artifact, though. <laughs> I'm so glad I got an achievement for it, too. I, I feel like I should have known. Like, there are so many achievements in this game that are just for doing the silliest thing. And I love it. That's what I'm here for. <laughs> Seems like I'm slowly beginning to incorporate the aperture science methods of scientific testing. Yes, yeah, truly, truly inspirational. Honestly, we could we could all learn a lot from Glados. Maybe not. Maybe not in hindsight. Uh, please don't become a murderous robot potato. All right, to the raft. I'm gonna try, try and find that hand in area two again. I hope. It's through these plants. And I go, oop. In a straight line. That was not a straight line, but it's okay. It's okay. And then the lift. Right, honestly, the, the annoying part of this is the fact that this is like the third area and I need to get to the second one, so it goes three, four, one, two. So I have to do like a full loop before I can reach the second area, but it's okay. I'll just go speedy. Gotta go fast. Oh, 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 nearly overshot that, but I'm fine. <laughs> 
After all, it's all but a bit of funny violence, so true. <laughs> oh, that's still one of my favorite moments from playing Portal. Just the moment of, uh, Liri, what happened to not hurting the turrets? And my answer was just funny violence. <laughs> Right, pretty sure it's not here. Boop boop. Area four. Let's go to area one. I'm just keeping an eye out all the time as well for like a tree and a bridge. Because it might not be area one. It might be like this area. Because there are trees here. There's a big old tree there. No, I'm not seeing like a. I'm not seeing a hand I can zoop to. I think it has got to be area, to area two. <laughs> oh, I'm not here for safe science. I like. I like dangerous science. But uh, thank you for the hydrate as well, Gambler. I will have a sip. Before I continue on my perilous quest. Onwards. Oh, listen to them singing though. It feels so sad. And now we're going to load into area two. And now I need to keep an eye out. For the right moment. Um, like there's a tree on the left and then the bridge going like over a little further along here I think yeah I'm about to turn the corner here and when I do I'm pretty sure there's the bridge going across here bridge and tree would it be here oh I may have just missed it maybe it's like there Maybe. Oh, unless it's like... Unless this raft is going in a different direction. Because I'm not seeing that specific tree here. Maybe there's a different raft I can get in this area. I don't know. I'm going to do another lap. And see if it might be that little bit that I went too fast for. But uh, I'm not sure if maybe it'll be like... I think there was a raft in area two that I could have gotten possibly? I don't know. We'll see. Be up there. No, I, I'm just gonna speed. I'm gonna speed run now. Speeding all the way through. Until I get to area two. <laughs> I can't believe this one is taking me so long. I feel like I should have been able to zoop to it by now simply by waving my thing around focused, but apparently not. Zooming through one. At least it does go pretty fast when you do it like this. Oh, unless it's like here. No, I, I already tried that. I already tried it. It didn't work. Oh, and Gambler! Oh, thank you for the luck! Oh, I hope you sleep well. Thank you for stopping in before you go to bed, though. I very much appreciate it. Yeah, there's the, the hut. I saw that hut. In, in the, the real thing. Is that it? It's not that. That's like a telescope. But uh, it's about to turn the corner now, so I think it'll be here. It, was it that? The crack in between the rocks? No, because it was way higher up when I saw it. It's like, oh, I don't know. So lost in this place. 
Oh, I hate area two. Yeah, I'm way past it now. I can tell I'm past it now. Ugh. Do I do another lap? I'm gonna do another lap. I'm gonna try one more time. I'm gonna try looking further down. I, d I don't know if I'm looking too high up. But uh, I... I wonder if I can make the raft go slower if I put out some of the candles? Because I know putting out all of the candles makes the raft just disappear entirely. But I wonder if it will go slower if I just blow out like three of them. <laughs> I'm gonna test it. I'll test it when we get into the second area to see how slowly I can float through. <laughs> da -da -da. This is, it's not up there, is it? No. Nope. No, it's, it's got to be area two because that's where the well is. So if I want to put out the alarm for the well, I need to be in the area with the well. Oh, there goes the dam. Everyone is going to perish soon. <laughs> oh, there they go. Yep, they, they all just died here. Yeah, that's so interesting as well then, that there's like the death sound as the supernova's about to start. Like what? Like in the third area, like... Because I didn't think anything happened in the third area. Okay, I'm going to extinguish. Okay, it doesn't seem to be going any slower, but at least I tried. Right, so now I'm not going to look as high up. I'm going to look more like this level. Because there was like the little bit like between the rocks here. Is it here? Is it here? Is it here? If it is there, I did not see it. Don't know where it is. Oh, is it going to be on the other s No, hold on. Unless, if there's a tree, like, on this side... Maybe it could be, like... Over here instead. I don't know. I'm not sure. Maybe I need to activate more things in the second area before it will... be, like, visible enough. I don't know. I don't know. Let's just go back to this area. We're just sticking three for now. I've I've wasted a lot of time doing this. But I might still be able to do it, possibly. If I don't get lost, I'm definitely going to get lost, but <laughs> Okay. Wow. I made it. I think I'm gonna get lost. But it's okay. <laughs> Oh, and I need to try and remember where the bridge is as well, because I need to get across from the other side. I can't get in to the area I need from this side. So I need to take the, the bridge back. Oh, but I can't see! Why didn't I light the candles? I can't see! I can't see anything. I made a mistake. I forgot to light the candles at the top, and now I can't see. So, uh, I'm probably going to fall off. Oh no, this is the right, right way. <gasps> oh my god. Oh, I made it. <laughs> oh my goodness, I can't believe I made that. Ah. <sighs> Right, I don't know if there'll be like any time whatsoever, but let's try. <laughs> let's see how much I can do. Because I know there's a way to get around to that room from the other side. Yeah, because it's like in here, 
this is like I can use this to build a bridge to get across but I can also hopefully use it to extinguish but I know I've been around that side I just don't remember how I got there I think it may have been a, a hand yeah I think it's downstairs from here and then the hand pulls me over hey what is that door I don't know. Let's go over to the other side. Yeah, there's the one watching watching shows. Watching projections. Having a nice time. Right, these yeah, these doors are ones that can go through if the lights are extinguished. The lights are all lit at the moment, but I wonder, can I... Can I go through them if I'm in the matrix? No, not with the lights lit. I need to figure out how to extinguish them. Right through here, was this the way, I think? Oh no, that's back into the uh, the the reels room. I'm just gonna leave them to it in there. They, they're having a nice time. It's another. Clo There's so many closed doors. I need to turn off so many lights around here. How do I turn off the lights? Right, yeah, because this is how I got across. Is it? Hold on. Maybe. Hmm. Right, well, I think I want to be upstairs. Yeah, because that's the hand to get back, but I need to figure out how to turn those lights off first. I think it's in here. I think the thing might be in here. Yeah, here it is. Here it is, because like, I can do that and make the bridge. And then, oh no, it only extinguishes the bridge though. How do I extinguish everything else in there? I need to like extinguish all of the lights in there. I have no idea how to do that. Hmm. There are the hands there and back. Uh, hmm. You know what? I'm just gonna get that bridge back. <laughs> I don't think I can travel through the hands like at an angle. Oh, this room is so big. <laughs> okay. Oh. What was that? Is the sun about to explode? There's nothing I can light up from this way. All right, so I made this bridge here. But I don't know how to extinguish the lights down here. That's what I need to figure out. I need to figure out how I can extinguish these lights to get through here. But I don't see like an extinguishing thing around that would reach. Is there something like up there maybe? Hmm. Very mysterious. There's so many doors I haven't been through as well though. It's <laughs> I wish I could extinguish them. Yeah, I 
need to figure out how I can extinguish them, but I don't know. Hmm. Yeah, because that's just for the bridge. The other one is making this bridge across. Hum. Oh, oh! I see where it leads to, at least. That's what I'm aiming for, at least. Okay, so that's what's on the other side of that door. I wonder if I can reach that without having to open the door. In some way. I, I don't know if the fall... I think the fall might kill me. The only directions I can think of, I think the fall would kill me. Trying to reach that. Okay, and that's the end of the loop. Also, L Adeline, oh, thank you for hopping in for a bit. Welcome, welcome. I hope you're doing well. I hope you <laughs> enjoy me just mulling things over to myself here. Yeah. But hi, welcome, welcome. Welcome on into me trying to figure things out. See, I'm wondering if I need to extinguish those lights, if there's a way I can get to the other side of that painting without having to extinguish the lights, then, like, if there's a way I can access that, that bridge, like, I know that's where the painting leads to. So maybe I don't even have to turn out all the lights. I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try many things. But first of all, let's have another look at... Oh, where is it? Is it this one? One more look at this awful, awful... <laughs> okay, this one is like walking through the, um... The what's it called? The, the ruined building? and then taking a raft in a different direction. I think the raft is going through the middle and the raft I'm taking from three is going around the edge. So I think I may have to enter there from the second area. And I think that's what my mistake has been because I've been so fixated on, oh, there's a raft here. I can do everything from this raft, but it's kind of skirting around the edge of area two. It's not actively going into area two. So, you know what we're going to do? We're going to go to area two. We're going to enter from there again. <laughs> and see if I can find this awful hand. Please. Please, I want to find it. But uh, I think, sadly, there isn't going to be a way for me to get into that area from the raft. From three. So I think I am stuck on a time limit, like the same time li limit as the rest of the people there. So I don't think I can wait for them all to perish before I explore. I think it's gonna be more, more like risky stealth where I will actually have to try and avoid them. But I think I can do that. I think I can, I can juke them. I know how to hide my artifact. And I don't know, I don't think there's an artifact in the second area, so let's pick it up from, from over here, from our lovely workshop. Bonk. I really like that there's a rock right here. It feels like this rock was placed to park my raft. I, I feel like that rock was put there to make things easier for me personally. Nobody else, just me. And I very much appreciate it. It's a good rock. Right, got my artifact. Let's head to area two. Electric Boogaloo. Uh, of course I'm fun to watch. Oh, I'm so glad. I'm glad you think so. Because these games are fun to play too. I have such a blast playing this. It's 
so fun. I really love this game. Right, onwards. And I feel like I've discovered so much this stream as well. Like it, it feels, feels like progress. <laughs> it feels like I'm doing well as opposed to last time when I was like driving past the first area multiple times in a row. <laughs> when my brain just was not working in the slightest. I feel like my brain is working in the slightest today. The slightest, a little bit. Right, so now let's go up here. I've got my artifact. Let's try and turn this well off. If I can figure out where that raft is. It's like, I know where the raft is. Like, the raft seemed to be like you go through the, like, the ruined broken hut. And there's a raft on the other side of that, and that's what leads to the the path where there's the the hand to Juptu. So I think my problem was I was literally just on taking the wrong path with my raft. I think I'm just I forgot that that's not the only raft in the game. <laughs> There are more rafts, especially here. Ba -ba -ba -ba. I, I, I did a full 180 spin there. <laughs> oh, goodness. Okay. Right, time to try and get my bearings. Oh, it's the jump scare flowers. Hi. Yeah, where's like the, the damaged hut area? Oh wait, I can light the candles in this tunnel too. It's so dark. Okay, that's a lift spot. It's back. With the water. Oh, there's a hand here. Pretty sure this is not the hand. And I had to get over there. I'm trying to figure out whereabouts the the broken hut is in comparison to everything else. I didn't mean to zoop over there, but it's okay. <laughs> Isn't the other half going to be jealous if I find a new one? It's probably going to be relieved. It'll just be like, oh, thank goodness, this this girl kept uh, drowning us. I don't know why I came over here. Is this the right way? Uh huh. Maybe it is. Oh, that's where the lift is. So I could use that to send the lift down if I wanted to. Oh, there's the hut. There's the um the abandoned hut. That's where the raft is. Oh, the sound effects here always put me so on edge. Oh, is it? No, this is just like a bridge walkway. Oh no, this is where I started. Ah, I did a lap again. Okay, but I might still be able to figure out from here. Hmm. What's going on down there? Is that... Oh no, that's the no entry sign. That's the no entry sign. I know what that is. Hmm. Is that the dam? I have less time than I thought I did. What's through here? Is this- oh this is how to make the- the bridge to get down there. Yeah that was the dam going. I do not have much time before I am forcibly ejected from the universe. Yeah, I'm not sure where I need to head here. Let's, let's go down. Da -da. Oh, this is like towards the well. Yeah, this is the way to get I presume to the well once the lights are off. Hmm. 
Hmm. I'm just gonna have a little explore. Yeah, there's the well, but all the lights are on, so I can't approach that yet. So I know the way to get here, but I don't know how to turn these lights off. Because I've not figured out how to find a raft or a little hut that I can travel on. Oh, it's a really nice tree, though. Where else can I go around here? Right there is hand. Give me a hand. There's a lift, like, right up there. How do I get up there? Hmm. There's no hand I can zoop to around here. Hmm. I am very... very baffled by this place. Also, I don't know what it is, but like the, the sound effects and the sound design in this area kind of reminds me of uh, Rusty Lake. Like the almost pipe-like, like the... like that specific note. Always makes me think of Rusty League. Wait, I wonder if I can... I don't think I can bring this down from here. Hmm. Uh, more alarms? Oh. Wait, the sound stopped. Oh, and it's back again. What? What is happening? Maybe I stepped somewhere. <laughs> hmm. Right, I'm gonna try something very silly here. I'm gonna see if I can avoid the alarms by um, not having my artifact with me. Don't no, the alarms are still going. But uh, maybe from here I can see the angle I need to be at for other things. Whoop! Yeah, it can. It can definitely see me. <gasps> Wait, I can extinguish this. Oh, that's a candle. That's why. Never mind. These are just candles. <gasps> Can't see me if the candles are out. Oh. Yeah, I wish I knew how to extinguish these. I wish I knew where that hand and raft were. <laughs> Ugh, it's... it's like it goes under a bridge and there's like a tree on the left and then the, the zoop point to the right. But it can't tell I'm here when the lights are off. Ugh. A lift up there. There's a lift there. That, yeah, that lift to the top just goes all the way down. There's a lift up there. There are a lot of lifts. I, I don't know if I can... Can I get up there? I wonder if I can get that high. With a lot of these things. The. I wish I knew how to turn these off. I didn't think it would be so difficult to find. Like, as soon as I found the reels, I was like, well, I'm set now. I know exactly what I have to do. I didn't expect it to be this tricky to find out what that thing is. <laughs> but alas, here I am. There, that's the Rusty Lake sound. <laughs> Back to the beginning. All right, what if I go back up on the roof? What if I just 
do that. Wait, no, is this where the raft is? Wait, I'm so silly. I'm pretty sh Aww. I can summon a raft here. I'm- oh my- I'm- I forgot about this. And the- the dam's just gone. I'm about to wake up. I forgot about this. This is where the raft is. Ah! I love how I even walked up there and I was just like, I don't need this. But I do. I think I know what I have to do here. I know exactly what I have to do here. I know what I'm doing. For once. Also, watch this. <laughs> watch this. Hee <laughs> hee. But yeah, I'm, I'm about to get forcefully drawn out of here. But I know what I have to do now. And it's really, it's really similar to the, the first area. It is so similar to the first area. What I need to do is I need to go to the second area. I have to bring up that dock with the raft bit. And then I need to go to the third area. And that's how I get into the second area from the third. And I won't immediately wake up when everyone else does. And it may, hopefully, also take out the lights as I do it. Maybe. I don't know. I'm not sure about that much. But uh, I'm, I'm pretty sure that is going to work. I'm pretty sure that's a decent plan of action. Ugh. I'm surprised it's not woken me up yet. I'm still awake here. I wonder if I can get to the gorge and pop in over there and maybe I can actually do this. Maybe. Oh, do I even still have a raft here? Probably no. <laughs> okay, wait, no, there is a raft. There's a raft like... And get that raft. The raft I got from before go here. Right, I'm gonna try and get to the gorge again. <laughs> it's probably really silly to do. I don't know what point in the cycle I'm at. I don't know if I have any time, but I, I'm gonna at least try. But I'm pretty sure that's what I have to do now. And I think it's gonna be more time, like, I should probably jump into two as fast as possible to get that dock down as fast as possible then head into three and start doing things from there but this feels positive this feels like what i probably have to do maybe we'll see we'll see how much i can get done before one i've got another loop in me at least though. Come on, come on. Bring me up. I don't think I have much time, but bring me up anyway. <sighs> oh, but yeah, I, I, I love when I get the moment of, I know what I should do now. And what I need to do is I need to make sure the dock is there before I start rafting from three, because otherwise I can't get up. But then I can get up once I've put the dock there and I have a spot to jump off to. Be sleepy. Also, Dima, thank you for the hydrate and posture check. I will have a big stretch. And I will have a sip of my monster. Thank you very much. Okay. Stop giving me the tutorial. I know how to do that. I know I know you want me to do that because it's like stealth mode over here, but I know how to do that. Okay. Okay, I'm in three. We're gonna head to the raft. I know I don't have much time, 
but I'm still going to try my best. Yeah, whatever. Da, da, da. Yeah. However much time I have left, I'm, I'm gonna try and make the most of it. <laughs> But now that that dock is down and... And I know I can get off the raft there. I, I, I wonder if... I, I really want to know where that hand is. I've got to figure it out. I, I feel like I need to scope out Area 2 more. I, I don't know the layout of Area 2 enough to know how it works. So I need to... I need to like map it out in my mind a bit more. Which I realize is hilarious for someone like me to say that with how how little like directional awareness I have of anything. But I want to try. See, I'm usually pretty good at directions when I can get like landmarks to work off and use that as a reference point. My problem is when I'm like in the middle of a forest and my reference point is a tree, and then there's like twelve trees. That's like <laughs> that's when I get lost. Right, but because with Area 1 I had to open the door before I could do stuff here from 3. But now in Area 2 I know I can just... I can summon the dock. And then I can... then I'll be able to do stuff there from 3 again. So I'm gonna be more free. Like, maybe the alarm will just go off. When the tower crumbles, maybe the alarm will just... stop. Okay, there's there's that little hut. That's the hut they went through. It's like, would the raft go that way usually? Hmm. So I thought it might be like through this gap. I don't see anything. All right, anyway, the the bit to jump off that is right here. Oh, I think they all just died. Okay. Uh, well, that makes my exploring a bit easier. Wah. <laughs> and if I look like from here, can I... It's like I can summon the raft again. I can only extinguish the raft. I was hoping I might be able to extinguish some lights as well, but... Oh no, there's the music. Yeah, there's... oh, they, they, they die like... That's the second death sound, I guess. Oh, that's interesting. All right, I'm gonna go stand on the roof just so I can like try and scope things out. That is, that is my current plan. It's a terrible plan. But maybe I can see something from up here. I, I think I'm just going to see black. I don't think I'm actually going to see anything. But it's worth a try. Right, yeah, I'm so I'm so high up, I just see black. I see darkness. The artifact here, let's see. Can I exit the matrix? Like the Yes. Okay. Okay, I can see the area quite well now. From here, but I still don't know where that hand I have to zoop to is. Where is it? Cause I'm trying to see, cause like in this view, like the important things are white instead of like the tealy cyan. So I was wondering if I might be able to see the hand I zoop to to get more of an idea of like where it is, but I can't see. I can't see anything from here. It's okay. I didn't think I would be able to. Can I perch on the edge here? There we go. Yeah, I, I have no idea. No idea.
Let's do one last loop, and I'm gonna try area three. I'm going to try and see if I can get onto that bridge without turning off the lights for that painting. It might amount to nothing. I'm, I'm probably going to just die multiple times, but I want to see if there's a way I can like just skip the doorway entirely and just land on the bridge because I saw that bridge in my matrix view. So I know where it is. The question is just like, is there a way I can access it where I won't take a ridiculous amount of fall damage? Because I can see several places I would be able to reach it. They're from quite high up. I don't think it would work as planned. It's okay, it's... This is the time for experimentation for science. I feel like I've discovered enough through my wild theories that I, I will indulge in my wild theories. I wanna, I wanna try, I wanna at least try. See, I'll, I'll just like look at it from every angle, see if there's a way I can get around. Or like if there's a way I'd be able to get down in a slightly safer way. Right, in we go. Match velocity, do a little- oh, I'm- I'm upside down. Hold on. It. It. There we go, perfect. Perfect landing! We're doing science and we're still alive. I mean, it's it's a little bit debatable. I've I've died many times, but that's okay. But hi, Mag. I hope you're doing well. Welcome, welcome. Out of wild theories with with Leary, but but that's just a theory. A Leary theory. I think part of the fun of this game is theorizing as well, though. I I love just coming up with ideas and being like, oh, I wonder if this thing could be because of this. And then either being proven horrifically wrong or being proven right and feeling like a genius. Like, I'm still really proud that I picked up on the fact that uh, the Harthian survived the, the ghost matter thing because of still being aquatic at the time and like the water neutralizing the ghost matter. I'm, I'm still very proud of that moment. That made me feel clever. It was a good time. And Mactan SC, hello! Welcome, welcome! Welcome on in, welcome to um, Silly Theories with Leary Leary. <laughs> I'm very good at doing very silly things in this game and it, it's honestly such a joy how many times it actually pays off. Like the amount of times I've done something and been like, this is probably silly but I'm going to try it anyway, and then it actually works out. It's, it's very nice. It's very nice. But yes, the science is going incredibly. I've, I've learned so many things in this stream, and I'm there's still so much I don't know as well, though. Like, I don't know what's been sealed up in that vault. I still need to know what's going on there. But uh, my current wild theory is that it's a person, and it might be the person that's missing from that bed. But I have nothing to base that on other than the fact that there are, like, memories coming from it, and also that someone was missing from that bed. I don't know. But I'm I'm so curious to find out more. I, I I must unseal it. Right, but yes, we are trying the third area. I just had a moment in my head where I was like, did I just drive past the second one when I didn't mean to? But no, no, I didn't. I didn't. I did mean to go this way this time. <laughs> it's okay. I've got my artifact. I'm ready to enter the matrix. And hopefully figure out what's going on. We'll see. Let's 
see how this goes. Uh, in I go. Because I have no idea where all the people from this area are either. There's every possibility that I could get onto that bridge and walk across it and they're all just going to like gang up on me on the other side and remove me from the premise, premises. Right, because what I need to get to is like down here. Down here there is a bridge, an invisible bridge. that I want to try and land on somehow, but I'm way too high up to do that at the moment, so... Let's start by making this bridge. And go across here. And now I can start scouting out. Yeah, because the other bridge is like directly below this one. And through the painting. So I wonder if there's a way... I can get, like, onto that, like, balcony. Get onto the lower down balcony without turning the lights off. Hmm. So, see, if this... Oh, this is the door that can be opened from the, the lift side. Like, if I entered through the lift, I'm, I think I would be able to open that, maybe? Oh, I don't know, actually. Hold on. No, the, the lift enters, like, over there. Hmm. Right, well, I'm, I'm gonna go over and get this bridge back to start with, if I can remember how. Oh, it's down. Ow, I'm fine. here. Yeah, and there are so many doors that are closed because the lights are on. If I could just figure out a way to just mass turn off every light in this area. Actually, that would be quite scary. <laughs> hmm. I'm going up here. Yeah, this is the massive room, and then if I go to towards the end of here, I can create that bridge across so I can reach the other side. Now I can use the hands to zoop back. It really feels like there should be more here. Like, it kind of unnerves me that there's nobody around. Because it feels like there should be. It feels like there should be so many people around here. Right, and then I go back. And now I have a, a bridge so I can get across to... this side of the room. So now the question is... Is there a way I can get down there safely without turning off all the lights? Because I don't know how to turn all the lights off. Oh, it looks like there's another floor further up, but I don't know where that- Oh, here are the stairs for that. Let's go up. Oh yeah, that's the way I entered. Aha. Uh -huh. So this is- definitely too high. I love that it gives me the option to drop artifact when I'm like right at the edge of the bridge like that. That would be a smart idea. Go across here. Around here. Right, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna leave the artifact here for a second. Can have a walk around here. I can't get through that way. From here. But, hmm. 
There's this hunt over here. I, w I wonder how this door opens. And what's on the other side there? Like, what is through that door? Looks like it would be like around here. It's like on the other side of this wall, there is a room. I have no idea how to... access that. Hmm. Right, now I'm going to... I'm gonna put the artifact really far away for a bit. I put it like right here. Because <laughs> I want to explore things in the matrix for a bit. Yeah, another closed door. There's so many closed doors! <laughs> okay, I'm higher up now than I was. That's another closed door. Of course it is. Have I been this high before? I don't know if I have. Oh yeah, I have, because this is where the concert is. <gasps> oh. <gasps> oh. Oh. Oh, I need my artifact. I need my artifact. Okay. I see what I can do over there. Time to hopefully remember my way. <laughs> I need to remember my way around. <laughs> I go this way. I can go down here. This is where the little concert's happening. Or it would it would be happening, I guess. And then I know there's the invisible bridge across here. And with my artifact... <sighs> I just extinguished everything in that house. <gasps> oh. What was that sound? I did not like that sound. I think they may all be out to get me now. I have a feeling they're all going to be out to get me now. Because I turned all those lights off. Oh, I hate this. Oh, I hate this. I can't see. I just... I just can't see. I think they're gonna eat me. Oh, and some of the others dying. Uh... <laughs> Because the ones here aren't gonna die, because this is like a safe spot. Oh god, I'm... Where am I? Okay, that's where the bridge would have been. Where am I? Oh, these are all the little rooms I couldn't get in before. But I can now because the lights are off. I've got to say, this is the first time in this that I've genuinely felt a little afraid. Will I die if I fall down here? I don't remember how high up this is. I'm going to try it. Yeah, I did. <gasps> okay. <laughs> oh, wait, but what if I go back in now, the lights should still be off. Can I... I think I can sneak around the other way. 
I think I can sneak around, like, down the, the pathway. Like, I won't go over here. I'll go, like, over this way and around the side. And I think I can get in that way because I'll be on the right side. Oh, God, I'm genuinely really tense now. I, like, the lights going off there and that... That call very... I'm very on edge now, and I'm scared to light any of the candles in case they give away my position. I am terrified. There's a lift, there's a lift. Oh god, this is really scary. I don't... This is really scary. Okay, I'm going down. I'm gonna stay concealed as I go down. I'm so scared. I'm so scared. Oh. <gasps> Whoa. Whoa. goodness <gasps> the thing oh my god the thing the thing hold on I need to see if there's a matrix bridge here <gasps> there is god, I'm a genius ha 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 it's burnt! Of course it is! Oh, that's like glitchy in here. Oh! The burning there is very glitchy. Oh, oh. Oh. Okay, I'm gonna stick in the matrix for a little bit because it makes me feel a little more confident. What is this? No, I need to bring my artifact. Never mind! Never mind. Uh, you're so angry. That was ingenious and you're so angry. Uh, you're welcome. <laughs> uh, it was accidental genius. I forgot that I could get around from there until I died. I thought me dying was going to be a really terrible, terrible thing. But it actually kind of worked in my favor here. Okay, where are these? Reels. Okay, reels. Okay, real time. Real. What do we got? It's story time! Okay, this is the one on the bottom now. There we go. Oh, I... Okay, that's... Yeah, that's our solar system. Wait! <gasps> that's before Bramble destroyed everything, I think. That's like the actual planet that used to be th there. Before Dark Bramble ate it. Oh, look, they're looking at their old home world. Oh, wait, just comforting that one in the front here as they sob. That's devastating. Okay, what is this? Ooh. Projection. Oh, this is them making the world. Like, all they had were the reels and the memories. But they made the artifacts so that they could get back into that world. They're like reminiscing everything they lost. And so they remade it in the Matrix. There's the confirmation if I needed any that they, they created that world. Oh, this is so good. This is so good. Oh, I can't reach that one. Hold on. Yeah, got it. I can't believe it made me jump for it. Slide wheel. Oh. What's this one? Another Oh, another glitch. Another glitch. I'm here for another glitch. Walking along. 
Oh, this this teaches you how to enter the matrix. The thing that I discovered by accident when I realized that I died as the artifact went out and I was like, what if I just leave the artifact behind? <laughs> nice. Oh, so this is showing the the glitches and how to how to achieve them. Nice. So that one was basically useless for me. But I am still so glad I found this place. Oh, it shut the door. Okay, is there anything else around here? Hmm. So many that are too high up for me to reach. As expected. And yet that sure is burnt like all the other ones. Good times. Um, I wonder if there's anything else I can do here. Like... Oh, cause I- oh! Hmm. Okay. I don't know if there's anywhere else I can reach from here. Cause yeah, that door only opens when I put the artifact in, so I- I'm like here. Oh, there's a door here. And it's going to be shut because all the lights are on. Oh, I'm so glad I found this though. I'm so glad. I finally made it. Alright, what happens if I walk along here? Whoa, look at the hat though. What is going on? It's like beams from heaven. <laughs> and yeah, that is very burnt. I really would like to know what the codes are for these, but <laughs> Yeah. Oh, I'm glad I found this though. Hum. Hum. More death. Oh, okay, the, the sun's about to explode. The sun's going to explode in a minute, so I'm good. That was an incredible, incredible thing to end the stream on. I am so glad that I found this. Yeah, here we go. Sun's about to... about to destroy everything. But, oh, it was definitely an excellent solution, though required knowledge of that invisible bridge on the right. Yeah, but I found all of the invisible bridges because I'm... I just keep leaving my artifact behind everywhere. <laughs> It's the best. I'm I'm so glad that worked. I may miss because I don't have like Oh, okay. A point to aim for. Here we go. Anything else on here? No. I don't think there's anything else on here, but I'm I'm so glad I thought of Oh. Oh hi! Okay, well, I've, I've already found everything I wanted here. You can blow that out. That's fine. Thank you. Wow, I got so lucky. Marshmallow for the end of the world. Marshmallows for the end of the world. How many of these can I eat? I keep sticking the stick in there without a marshmallow on it. I missed. Yeah. Yum. Crunchy. I got the crunch. I got the crunch. That was so cool. I'm so glad. I'm so glad I found that way around quite early on because I I remember like when I went down the lift I was like I wonder if I can skirt around and got like a little shortcut there. 
And I can imagine otherwise that's like hell stealth mission, trying to get back the long way around. I'm... I didn't want to do that. I did not want to do that. <laughs> so dying there kind of helped me out. <laughs> oh, that was great. I'm so glad. I'm so happy I found that. And we, we did run over. We did run over on time a bit. 100% worth it would run over on time again. But I should probably head to bed soon. <laughs> It is 1.17 a.m. now. Oh, it's probably single-handedly responsible for the refuse, reduced frights option being in the game. That would not surprise me. That wouldn't surprise me. That was like the first moment in the game where I genuinely felt fear. <laughs> well, like in the DLC at least. I felt fear with the anglerfish many times. And here, a library full of intact slide reels hidden deep underground. There is a container marked with one of the vault seals, but its contents have been destroyed. I found a slide reel that shows the stranger's inhabitants congregating around a strange green fire. Intact slides reveal the creation of a simulated reality modelled after their home moon. I found a slide reel that appears to be some sort of error report. It shows one of the stranger's inhabitants dropping their artifact on the ground and walking beyond its projection radius. I love that I discovered that so soon in the game. Because... Without that, everything would have been so much harder. I am so glad that I, I decided like, oh, I die when my artifact goes out. What if I just leave it behind? <laughs> that really helped me. But oh, we're making so much more progress now. So now it's just the rest of the sealed vault stuff, which will happen naturally when we do this. And then there's more to explore in the Starlit Cove. Which I know, because it's that whole well that has an alarm going off. And I still don't know where that hand is, but that is something for next time. So with that, I shall quit the game. Oh, that was a really nice discovery point to leave off on, though. <laughs> and with that, I shall bloop. I'll head on over to here and we can find a raid target. GG, thank you. Thank you. That that felt really good. That felt so productive. I actually felt smart today. <laughs> I feel like for the past couple of Outer Wild streams, I've I've been having so many like brain empty moments that a little part of me's been doubting my intelligence <laughs> because of it. <laughs> but I, I feel redeemed again this week. I feel redeemed. That went really well. That went really nicely. That was so fun. And so I know what I've got to try and do next time, and it's basically... I'm pretty sure I just have to try and figure out where that hand is. In the second area. I wish I knew where it was. <laughs> oh, I need to figure that out. But it's okay. I've, I've got a week to theorize and think of more ideas. And maybe look back on my VODs and see if I miss things. <laughs> But this was so fun. Thank you so much, everyone, for, for joining me on this beautiful journey. I love this game. I love this game so much. I love it. It's so good. The only thing you doubt sometimes is my memory. Oh, no, no, doubt that all the time. Even when I'm smart, my memory is still abysmal. It's why I have so many notebooks. It's why I make notes on everything. I can say something and then forget it five seconds later. <laughs> it's like my... My physical memory doesn't work, so I have to have artificial memory in the form of making lots of notes and setting lots of alarms on my phone. <laughs> but yeah, thank you everyone. I hope you've also enjoyed me on this journey. This game is just always such a joy to play. I always have so much fun with it. But yes, let's find a raid target. Let's see who's live. Who shall I send the raid to? Oh, there's quite a few people that I know online. Ooh! Oh, I could raid Neuro! A uh, Neurosis VT? Uh, she is very, very cool, and I've not had the chance to raid Neuro yet, so that could be fun. Because it's currently, a, it's a Final Fantasy XIV stream, but it's a uh, MSQ replay. 
Oh, it is Endwalker. I may have to look away. I've I've not finished Endwalker yet. I have no. Way. Oh no, no. This is this is a part of Endwalker I've done. I'm safe. <laughs> I'm safe. <laughs> it's early Endwalker. We're fine. We're fine. I'm not spoiling myself. <laughs> but uh, here's the raid message. If you're subbed, we've got the Outer Wilds Liri raid with the fire. If not, we just have regular fire because there was there was plenty of fire. There was a decent amount, decent amount of lava and sun explosions. But yes, I'm going to send you over to Nya, who is doing some uh, replaying Endwalker quests in Final Fantasy XIV. I'm I'm still at like level 85 in Endwalker. I need to play more. I'm I'm like halfway through, and I just. I keep running out of time to play it. I want to play it. <laughs> I'm never beating the arson allegations. No, but this was like the fire setting fire to me. I would not set fire to myself. <laughs> but no, it's just very unfortunate. Fire just follows me around. It is a shame. But yes, I'm going to send the raid over here. And then hopefully get some sleep because it's, it's very late. <laughs> But this was so much fun. Thank you so much. It's been a very fun time. I hope you enjoyed it too. I'm a little bit terrified for next week, but also excited for it. I just really hope I can find that hand. I, I don't know what else I can do. I just, I'm gonna have to try so many things. <laughs> but it's okay. It's okay. In between attempts at that, I can try and land on the sun station, which will be much much more fun and definitely not stressful <laughs> but yes that is it for me for now i'll be back again next week with a variety of things um i will post the schedule tomorrow when i've decided what i'm doing <laughs> but yes thank you so much everyone for joining me today and until next time bye bye